It's been 40 years since Sri Lanka played their first official test match here at the P. Saravanaputu Stadium. And here we are today for the shortest format of the international game, the T20 tournament of the SLC major clubs. This is the day that the two semi-finals will be worked out. After a long tournament over the last couple of months, BRC versus Colts is the first game coming to you live and exclusive here on the Papare.com networks on multiple platforms. It's dialogue channel number 140, the Sri Lanka Cricket YouTube page, the face, the Papare.com YouTube page, and of course the, the Papare.com Cricket Facebook page coming to you live and exclusive here from this historic venue on what is going to be the semi-finals of a very important tournament for Sri Lanka cricket. Unfortunately though, this is the scene that we are greeted to this morning. It was nice and bright when we came in, but unfortunately, just after the players had warmed up and gone back in to resume the game, we've seen the rains coming down ever so slightly. It's nothing to be alarmed about yet. Just for the safety, the crown staff have covered the square and as we wait on for the rain to cease so that we can get some much needed action underway. There's been a lot of cricket being played. There's international cricket going on. Australia here. But this is what the selectors will be looking at to figure out the next few potential talents for Sri Lanka. The ground staff walking around. Joining me this morning is Asela Laksa City Silva. Good morning. Looking forward to an action-packed day, Asela. Indeed. Good morning, Samir. BRC who won Group B in this tournament and calls who won Group C in this tournament. They are ready for a clash, a high octane clash in this first semi-final. So it will be interesting to see which team will qualify for the finals, which will be, which will take place day after tomorrow. And as you said, Samir, this will be a great opportunity for all the players who are knocking at the national team door because, as we all know, the national team is playing with Australia and Sri Lanka A is busy with playing with Australia A as well. So this is a great opportunity for all those players to make a name for themselves in these knockout stages. Indeed, a lot of busy times for the cricket fraternity here in Sri Lanka. Oh, look at that, that looks like good news. The covers are slowly coming off. The ground staff now pulling them off. I think they've got some word from the officials to try and uh, lift that cover off the square because the rain, the slight drizzle, when I say rain, it could be a bit of an overstatement. There was a very slight drizzle seems to have ceased now and we're seeing the sun breaking through the clouds not the brightest day of colombo by any means but we sure hope that it does remain this way and doesn't get darker so that we get some cricket underway a tournament that we've been repeating is of utmost importance to a lot of young cricketers from taking part in these four clubs remember it's two semi-finals today the first one being brc versus Coles in the evening in fact a little later in the afternoon the second semi-final will be Army versus the Saracens. All these teams, all four teams have been at the top of their game, have put in some really good performances. And today, it's the knockout match, the one that matters the most, the one through which they will book a place in the finals. That will happen on Friday, the 17th of June, 2022. And also something with the LPL coming up. As we said before, this will be at the perfect opportunity for the young players who are yet to play in the LPL because we had two seasons before so there are a lot of uh, players who are hoping to represent a side in the ILPL so uh, let's see which players will get that opportunity and as we mentioned before uh, calls they won group C they won defeated throughout the tournament they were played five and one five while BRC they have played five and they have won four matches so two notable uh, two, two, two notable teams and there are some high profile names as well and as we see, the umpires are walking into the middle. Yes, a good opportunity for these guys because remember, the national cricketers are out on duty. So, a lot of these teams are banking on their bench strength, which is good, of course, because generally what you find is that in a club game, the national cricketers just walk into the team. But here is an opportunity for these young men to prove themselves and cement a permanent place first in their club side and then to try and get into the development squads and then into the national team. Right then, we've seen what the weather looks like. We've seen the situation on the ground. Let's go and find out from our friend Garmini Pereira what the pitch looks like. Good morning, everyone. Sun is out in force. We had a little shower this morning. But it's muggy as I'll tell you what, you can feel it for sure. This is a beautiful venue. This is where Sri Lanka recorded their first ever test victory. And also, 
two legendary spinners call this ground home. For many years, bamboozled many batsmen. Muttai Mural Dharan and Rangana Hera, those were the two. Even though we had the shower this morning, outfield is still looking pretty good. You'll get enough value for your shots. Hardly any wind to speak of. So the square, let's see. As you can see, hardly any grass on this. This has been used few times this season. Hard, there are few loose cracks here and there. So batsman might pray that these will not come into effect. Like I mentioned, spinners call this ground home many years. Spinners will do a bulk of bowling in this match. Fast bowlers will have to rely on their pace and length variations. To the naked eye, it looks pretty good for batting, if you call it correctly. But because the weather around, it will be a tactical decision, no doubt. A few cracks and a bit of grass left on that pitch. So we'll try and find out what the teams want to do on what looks to be a day that will have a few breaks with the rain around. We've seen that happen quite a few times in Colombo the last few days. We've been covering this tournament. Remember, we've shown you some selected games here on the Papara Network. I mean, some good games, some low scorers, some high scoring thrillers. And today is the ones that matter, the semi-finals. How will the pitch play out is what Garmini told us. And now let's go to Mr. Harita Pereira, who's by the two captains for the toss. Cole Skandai Minayaka Akhil Dhananji. Tails is the call. Heads. Sampat. All right. Unfortunately, we couldn't really see exactly what went down there. But Harita Pereira just told us that BRC have won the toss and chose to bowl first. Wise decision, Asila? I think uh, that, that's a very good decision. So uh, let's see whether they can chase down the total set by cause later in the day. Yeah, both these teams do uh, represent a very strong lineup. Sangeet Kura, remember, called CC. He'll be opening the batting. He's been um, among the runs lately, and BRC with a few good names there. Kevin Kothigura is with a, bit of with, a bit, with a bit of experience in T10 leagues around the world. Uh, Dhuvind Ratna, another well known name among the highest wicket takers, too. This will be, should be a good battle. Akila Dhananjaya there for the call. So the spinners indeed will have a lot to do uh, today. First ball then. Bit of inward movement into the left-handed batter. We will see a bit of movement over cast conditions. Uh, generally with the new ball, you get that ever so slight movement. So it's important that the fast bowlers of BRC try and get a good start here because we know Colts have a strong batting lineup. They don't want them to get away easily. Mikum Sanjay is opening the bowling for BRC. Someone which we saw in national colours a few years back. Played real well in T20 format. So let's see what kind of start he can get today. Down the leg side this time. Erring in his line a little too straight. All the batter had to do was to get a little bit of glove onto it. Yes, the umpire signals had run. So a bit of glove there and the first boundary of the day. Colts are underway. Easy pickings there. A good start for calls, not so much for BRC. An early boundary will settle the nerves. Spoken of highly this week from Sanjay when he joined the national team, but lost his way a little bit. He is making a comeback with BRC this season. A little bit of up in the air, and that's taken. Wow, what a comeback from Vikram Sanjaya. What a comeback. A little fuller, a little straighter. Sangit Kure, the bat turning on his hand, hitting it straight back at the bowler, and good reflex catch there by Vikram Sanjaya. Instant reward. The first wicket goes down for Coles. That's a huge wicket, Samir. Sangit Kure, the man in form for Coles. So that was a great delivery by Vikram Sanjaya to remove the man in form. So this is a great start by BRC. Calls for the loss of one wicket at the moment. I just seen the first over yet. Sangeet Kure going for four after facing three deliveries.
Colts lose their first wicket in just the third delivery of the day. A boundary of the second one, an easy one there for Sangeet Kure. But unfortunately, the immediate next delivery, Vikram Sanjaya pitches it a little bit in front. And all he did was give back a straight and easy catch to Vikram Sanjaya, who'll be delighted to get that first wicket. This is Ravidura Sanda for Paul Samir, a highly rated youngster, someone who scored really well during the 2020 Under-19 World Cup. He was actually part of the team of the tournament, so he did really well, though the Shudha team didn't do that well during that edition. So let's see what Ravidura Sanda can do today. Slip in place for Vikram Sanjaya to the right-hander. Oh, that's nicely bowled and once again a leading edge. Not in total control there, the batter. Rasanta getting off the mark dangerously, but Vikram Sanjaya will be excited by that. He got a good, good delivery there. And this was the delivery that got rid of Sangeet Kure. Really nice shape inward. Sangeet Kure playing it straight back to Vikram Sanjaya. What do you reckon, Sami? What would be a good score to defend for BRC? For course. Well, I think we did mention earlier that it's going to be a stop start kind of day who steps forward and this time again it's the leading edge but oh a run out opportunity a direct hit would have had him in trouble and there's been the overthrow as well the ball will stop just before the boundary remember there's been some rain early this morning and last night so the outfield will be a bit damp won't travel as fast as we generally find it to which means the batters are able to cross over for a double as a result of that overthrow but good opportunity there at the non-strikers end direct hit and he was gone that he was struggling Got a good dive in yes a stop start kind of day expected today our sailor so i'm sure he won't be looking too big we've already seen how good this pitch is for the bowlers Vikram sanjay finding some shape there again away from the right hander that's the end of the first over call seven for the loss of one we got Off that first over, a wicket for Vikram Sanjay BRC drawing first blood in this encounter. Vishad and Rasanta are the one the batters on strike for Cold CC. Both these teams very strong. Should be a good encounter here. And what are gloomy conditions here in Colombo? I said you were talking about an ideal score to set here. I don't think the batter should be looking too far ahead. Anything that's 130, 140 should be a competitive score on a pitch like this. Gavin did say that we can expect some turn as the day goes on. Good spinners in their side. Akila Dhananjay, remember, plays for Cole CC. Got a lot of experience. Someone with a hat trick to his name in T23. So it's going to be quite interesting when he actually comes into the ball today. And this is uh, doing the Tilaka Ratna. Opening the bowling for BRC. One of the Tilaka Ratna twins, isn't he? Left armor early on spin as expected on a slow wicket like this. Rasanta will have to deal with one of the Flicker the brothers. Duvindu, that is, been among the wickets this tournament. Ooh, that went straight around, not much turn on it. Rasanta guiding that towards the field at point. He'll have to be watchful at the beginning, get a measure of the pitch. Duvindu, someone who's actually in the national set of trade as well, someone who has been in the wickets throughout the last few seasons. That's a good single. We'll have to steal those on wickets like this. Hit that straight to the field. A little slow there. Should have been cut off, but nevertheless, it's a single, so the strike has been better. No, I remember him being called for one of the test series. I just can't recall which series it was and unfortunately got injured. So couldn't really cement a place in that 11. But uh, this is someone that the selectors have looked at quite seriously. He's always been among the highest wicket takers in almost every season that he's played in so far. He's been a very important cog in the wheel of BRC. 
Ooh, reverse sweep early on in the game, but straight to the fielder. Decent effort there, but they will cross over for a single. The risky shots being played, but these are the kind of shots you have to play on, on tracks like this. We saw yesterday how um, Ashton Ega was, in fact, it was uh, Alex Carey who was employing the sweep shot quite a bit against the spinners. We saw a lot of sweeps, the conventional sweeps and the reverse sweeps yesterday by Alex Carey and Blaine Maxwell used the reverse sweep really well as well. That's the sweep sheet. So, that swept away once again, up in there, but lands safely between the two fielders. There's a fielder down at deep square leg and then at long off. Those are the two fielders in the deep. There's a slip in place, obviously, because it's a right-handed batter against the left arm spinner. You always have that edge constantly waiting for you. Four deliveries. We've already seen two kind of sweep shots, the reverse and the conventional. Again, it's another reverse sweep. Will that go straight to the field at square leg? Yes, it does. So just a single. They are playing that risky shot, but they're playing it well. Good execution. The sweep is something which most of the batters do to actually cope with the spin as we saw Joe Root losing that real well in Sri Lanka in the recent test series as well. So let's see what they will do, whether they will continue with sweeping the spinners. Driven down the ground. Key single for Asanta. So that's the end of the second over. Calls 12 for the loss of one wicket. We got six and over. Calls 12 for one at the end of two overs. These two batters have so far looked a little comfortable against the spin of two into the other. But Vikram Sanjay had a good first over. Found some shape away from the right hander. Troubled them a couple of times. Got the leading edge and got the wicket of the all important wicket of Sangeet Kure, who's the informed batter for Cole CC. Fresh off a half century in his previous game. It's a good wicket to have early on. This is full and it's been nicely hammered away down the leg side. That's a beautiful hit and it's a six. It was just picked up off his legs and nicely deposited onto that cow corner. Nicely played. As I said, Samir, a highly hated youngster for Sri Lanka cricket try on the Rasanta. That went all the way, got the power, the timing. Perfect by Rasanta. That's an area that generally when you slog sweep or hit that you clear your leg and you hit that big shot, that's where you go. But this time, Rasanta was in total control of that shot, picked it off his legs. And look at that, it's a six beyond the boundary. Very nicely played. So the first maximum of this first semi-final between Coles and BRC. A little too full there, Vikram Sanjay, spraying onto the pads. He'll want to be a bit more straighter. He's got a slip and a gully in place. And that gully, in fact, just comes out. TM Sampath there, the captain, making a couple of changes in the field. He's got, the, he's got a catching extra cover. We'll want Vikram Sanjay to get the batter to try and drive on the up on the offside. Yeah, that's nice. That's very nice. Movement away from the right hander. That's the kind of length you want to bowl on a wicket like this that's giving you that assistance. Very nice comeback. Yes, a good comeback by Vikram Sanjay using his experience after being hit for a six. Look at that, just shaped away from Ramadura Sanda. A perfect delivery. He has a reputation, doesn't he, Vikram Sanjay? He's not express. He won't trouble you with his pace, but it has that nippy movement that you're never really sure of which way it's going. Again, full. This time, it's not in total control. Again, Rasanta. It's the third time now he's got the leading edge off against Vikram Sanjay. So, want to play with a straighter bat. And as you mentioned, Sami, that was the speciality with Vikram Sanjay when he was actually brought into the national side. He could move the ball both ways. We saw the, him doing really well in one of the Australian tours, which Sri Lanka won. Calls 20 for the loss of one wicket after 2.3 overs. Sangeet Kure, the only batsman to depart so far. Vikram runs in once again. Oh, that's once again nicely played, very nicely played, down the leg side again and Rasanta, wow, what a nice looking shot. This time, 
a little more squarer, but the same result. Another six. Vikram Sanjay spraying onto the pads, and Rasanta is quick to punish him. Well, Rasanta, strong play in the leg side. He's showing that today as well. Two sixes so far in very short time. Man with a bright future on Rasanta. And it doesn't really bludgeon the ball or tries to hit it too hard. It's pure timing, isn't it? He knows where he wants to go and makes sure he gets the best part of the bat to try and get that away. So, very good batting there. It's straight. And again, a very good single. This is nicely done. A six. And then you cross over for a single. Get off the strike. Keep the bowler on his toes. So, under pressure, we come Sanjay in this over. He's gone for a few, for a few now. Colts have slowly upped their run rate. 27 for one in the third over. 15 runs in the over so far and there's one delivery remaining as well and as you said some of Rasan that that was really good I mean most of the young batters which we see today they fail to capitalize on scoring a boundary because of the dot balls which they build up after that the final delivery of the third over and this time they are unable to cross over for the single the fielder on his toes there at mid off good stop there so then our expensive over for Vikram Sanjay comes to the end three overs completed 27 for 1. Seven for one, Cole CC against BRC who happened to bowl first. They did pick up that first wicket of Sangeet Kure, but that last over, Vikram Sanjay went for a few, and now they've got off to a decent start. 27 for one, they'll, they'll, they'll regret that first wicket that they lost, but other than that, it's a decent start by them. 27 runs, and now it's Lahiru Samarakon, a bulky big boy from BRC. I've seen him batting and I know he can hit the ball a long way and he's a decent bowler as well. Comes at you faster than you might think. He was actually a part of the provisional T20 squad for the Australian tour as well. So he's someone who's in the national team red as well, Ayru Samarakon. A handy bowler and a power hitter. Someone possesses a lot of power. A genuine six hitter. That's a very good stop by the keeper. It should be called a wide unless the batter got something onto that. And they do manage to cross over for another extra as well. So, in fact, it's a leg by signal by the umpire. So, it looks like he may have got some hip to it. Probably brushing the thigh pad on its way to the keeper. But a good stop there by the keeper. Definitely saved a boundary. Could have easily been four leg buys. A good action, a very strong action by Lahiru Samarakon. Almost looks wrong footed when he bowls. Can confuse the batter sometimes. His coach, the PRC assistant coach Riza Tahir, rates him very highly. Spoken to him a few times about BRC and their setup. He's someone who rates Lahiru Samarakon very highly. That should be a wide. This time down the offside, over corrects himself. Mishad Vandiga, currently on four. Telling from Mizipan the College, someone who represented Sri Lanka under 19 in the 2016. Played under Chari Tassalanka's captaincy. Another youngster who has actually been really good in the domestic circuit. Inside edge, that should run away to the boundary. Unfortunate there for the bowler, but the batter won't complain. He won't mind. Yes, he's faced only five deliveries. He's not he's been out there since the big since the innings began. But it's the other batters who've got most of the strike. Vishab this time gets an inside edge to get his first boundary. Unfortunate for Lahiri Samarakon. That was a good delivery. You can say Vishab was lucky out there. Lahiri Samarakon. Good start so far. His first over. The keepers had some jumping around to do in this over. Saved a certain boundary off the leg side earlier. 
outside again. So he's been on the two sides of the wicket. The first one down the leg side, then a wide on the off side, then a bit more straighter, and that got the inside edge. This time again outside the off stump, just on that safe side of the tram line, so not called a wide. Plus 33 for the loss of one wicket, maintaining a run rate of over nine. A very good start by them. This time he's able to get some bat on it. And because of that misfield, it will be another single. So you want to 34. Vishad gets off strike. And Vasanthi is a batter you'd like to watch. He's played a couple of very nice shots for sixer, for sixers, both down the leg side. I'm going to try and take the game to Lahiru Samarakon. She's not the kind of batter who likes to wait around too long. This has been a very good partnership between Rasanta and Vishad. 30 runs for the second wicket in 19 deliveries. Well bowled. That's the kind of length in the line you need to be hitting on wickets like this. When you don't find early movement, when you don't, find have, when you don't have too much seam movement, that's the kind of length you want to be on. Create that doubt in the batter's mind whether you want to be on the back foot or the front foot. Is that the Sri Lankan team's squad, the, the, the women's squad? Yeah, yes, that's Shamari at the back, isn't it? Yes. They seem to be doing their practices here. They've got a busy times coming up. I've heard they've just confirmed a tour against India. India's coming here. The that should be a white. Pakistan. Yes, so they just came back from that tour of Pakistan. Not the most successful. They did manage to win one game there, so. They are going to be busy in the next few months. They've got a couple of tours confirmed. They actually competed well, lost some close matches. And ended the tour on a high when they won the final match. The final delivery of the fourth tour. Good effort there by Lahiru Samarkon. Tried to stop that single, but unfortunately. It went away from the fielder. So a decent over by Lahir Samarakon. Four overs completed. 36 for one. Well, the sun's out now. It's not as gloomy as it was in the morning when we came. There was a slight drizzle just before the start of play. But right now, it's nice and bright. And we don't see too many grey skies around. We hope they stay away. At least for the sake of these two semi-finals that we're hoping to show to you today. So this is the first game, BRC versus Colts. And then, it'll be followed by Army versus Saracens. Army, of course, very strong in their group stage, winning all their games. We've got some really good, well-known players from the national team. By this set of All right, then our focus is now on this game. BRC opting to bowl first. And here's a very unorthodox bowler, Kevin Kottigoda. He will be bowling the fifth over for BRC. He's got a very, very unique action. Takes time to understand and read him. He also gained worldwide fame when he played the T10. One of the main attractions of that tournament because of his unorthodox action. Let's see what Kevin Kottegoda can do. He, he did go through a very horrific injury. Now it's good to see him back now. BRC colors. It's, it's a single off his first delivery. Again straight to the fielder. Should be cutting that off early on in the T20 innings. You don't want the batters to settle down to keep rotating the strike. They must have got very good experience in the T10 league. You have some very star class players like Imran Tahir and all of them playing there. So lots of advices, lots of good coaching that have been done there while, during his time there. And he's been on the money so far. Two balls, both nice and straight. We haven't seen, haven't seen too much turn. Just a one spinner before this, Dovid Dutlera Couldn't see much turn from him. And we haven't seen too much from Kevin as well. Oh, that's nicely guided down to the third man boundary. The fielder opting to jump over it instead of giving it a chase, but he has to eventually. And he's able to cut that off the boundary just in time. So, three runs there. Nicely placed towards that third man region. Good running by Vishal and Rasanta. The score moves up to 40 for calls. 
after 4.3 overs. They're still in the power play. Maintaining a healthy run rate, these two batters for balls after the early wicket of Sangeet Kure. Once again. Next room, Rasanta. Wow, look at that for a stop. And that should be a run out. A brilliant take by the wicket keeper. And he's just in time to take the bails off. And the batter has given up. In fact, he's walking off. The umpire has given his decision. That is out. Wow. This is a brilliant display of fielding from BRC. Quite unfortunate, isn't it? But of no sudden effort by the fielder. That's quite good, isn't it, Samir? But quite unfortunate to see Ravi was on the go. He was timing the ball really well. He was playing really well. But an amazing effort in the field by BRC. The mastery that we got for them just before the end of the ball play. Created that wicket. Created the wicket out of nothing. Coles, who are going along well. Stitching together a partnership, these two, Vishar and Rasanta, has been undone by a superb effort in the field. 40 for 1. Lakshan, the new batsman for calls, another highly talented player, one of the popular names in the Sri Lankan domestic circuit. Played one ODI for Sri Lanka so far against England last year. And the all rounder he can open the betting, he can open the bowling. He's betting at number four today. He's one of many recent products of Richmond College. We've seen quite a few. Sri Lankan cricket has come off there. Now he's someone who's highly rated, as you said. He can bat, can bowl. Still remember his performances in the IPL, the LPL last year. That's where he really made a name for himself. But he'll be facing Kevin Kothigoda. He was one of the star players from the inaugural edition of the LPL. That's another look at that run out. Cut away. I don't think. Rasanta would have expected the fielder to cut that off, but he did that in style and ensured there was a perfect run out. Right then, five overs completed, 40 for two. When we come back, it'll be the two seniors, Harita and Garmini. Last of the power player was uh, coming up, and uh, the dismissal of uh, Ravidu Rasanta, a double centurion for Colombo Poles this season, previously in a tournament. Another one getting off to a superb start, brilliant bit of uh, fielding on the part of uh, Dushan Hemanta, and a superb pickup from Leo Francisco, the wicket keeper, resulting in that run out. Yes, his skipper. Tilakaratna Sampat. In place of uh, Banuka Rajapaksa on national duty. Very good morning, Gamini Pereira. Very good morning, Harita. Very good morning, everyone. Yeah, I think Kohl's will be pretty happy with the way things are going at the moment. I had a very close look at the pitch this morning, Harita. It's not, good, it's not the best figure that you'll ever see at Pisara Stadium. That I can tell you. It's... It's a used track. It's not going to get up that much. You have to be very careful if you're going to get on the back foot, particularly against the spinners. It's going to be two pace. It's going to be an invariable bounce. So I reckon I'm going to predict something here. I, I reckon anything between 140, 160 is going to be a formidable total. Yeah, I'll tell you, 140 is uh, a challenging one. 150 is uh, a total that uh, they would want to defend. 160 should be a winning score. Uh, I know about your experience here and your success. You have just brushed the pads. 
Well, Rabu Kallav put away with that appeal. Did he brush anything for that matter? <laughs> I think. Good one. But you cannot do. There is no, there is no, not enough space on the track, so you can't break your wrist too early. You need to get close to the ball as much as possible. That's well bowled by Sampa too. It was slower than his previous ball. Younger brother of uh, Tiragratta Dilshan. Experienced campaigner. Domestic level. Neatly played once again. Didn't try to overhit. Good running between wickets too. And then Jalakshan off the mark. Watch out for him, Ramini. A yeah, lot expected from this lad since he burst into the scene. Tananjay Lakshan. Kalambu Poles led by Akhil Dhananjay. Coach Shanuka Disanayaka. There you are. Again, oh. just held up a touch off the surface. Tilakaratna Sampat. I was just about to say Tilakaratna Dilshan. Tilakaratna Sampat um, is also very experienced at this level. Now he has playing. He has been playing first class cricket for years, hasn't he? Maybe 15 years, or even a bit more. A yeah, good run rate, 7.37. Good delivery again. The guy who will vary his speed is going to be a nightmare to face on a track like this. 43 for two after the first power play. the excitement real time be up to date with it all let us capture your milestones get it sizzling hot off the turf hear the experts break it down dig deep into the nitty-gritty be inspired by their greatness relive all the scintillating action Uh, Ravindra Kottachi, one of the on-field umpires. The other one is uh, Pragit Rambukwella. Udra Prasad is the uh, reserve umpire. Match referee, Brendan Kurupu. Officially, once again, a couple of runs. Bit slack uh, in the cover area, BRC. Tilakaratna Sampa moves out of that slip position. He moves to third man position inside the ring. What a unique action he's got. Also from and Richmond. He is, isn't he? So is Dhananjay Lakshan. So I'll tell you what. What makes it so unique is that Harita. He, see, the moment he raises his front arm where he gets his... He doesn't actually raise it that much, to be honest. But he doesn't really look at the spot that he wants to pitch the ball but if he gets any control I was looking at his uh, warm-up this morning from the side and um, he bowled with some good control watch out if he lands it on the spot you really can't fathom out which way he's going to spin and on a wicket that he's keeping low also it makes it that much difficult he's played in cricket Brilliant strike, brilliant strike. He knows him very well from the nets at school. Dananjay Lakshan, that was a king strike. You cannot strike a cricket ball any cleaner than this. That was the other way too, that went the other way. I think that was the wrong one too. That's why I said he's faced him in the nets at school. Let's go on to those old Air Force flats. The other side of the ground. Yeah. Got to get a new ball. Sanjeev. I don't think you'll find that in a hurry. Yes, Sanjeev Kadodarachi is uh, the manager of uh, Club Coles Cricket Club Cricket Team. Cricket Secretary is Malcolm Pereira from uh, the Hill Capital, famous coach. I played with his uh, younger brother, Roland Pereira. Live wire for Candy Youth Cricket Club. Fine cricketer, like his elder brother. 
Yeah, Coles happy to get to 50 for the loss of only two wickets. A bit gloomy. He seems to have got used this wicket pretty early. Tananjay Lakshan. After that tremendous straight hit, went on the back foot. Like I mentioned, this is not the easiest track where you can get used to as you come in. But he, he seems to find the correct speed and the bounce on this track. Kuti Goda. Finish. Well, that's not, that's not good cricket from BRC. I, I will come back to that. How tactically smart these cricketers have to be that you will lift your game that much to be very competitive at this level. 54 for 2, 7 down. Club clubs, uh, Colombo Coles and BRC. BRC led by Tilkaratna Sampat in place of Banuka Rajapaks on national duty. Coach is Pasan Banasinga. Manager Riza Tahir today, cricket secretary Pali Manukul Ratna for a long time. The first time uh, the um, Sri Lanka Cricket uh, Board of Control for Cricket conducted the uh, inter club T20 cricket. These two teams met in the final and the field inside won on that occasion. They're the good old neighbours, aren't they? Yeah, they, they share a lot. They have their cricket teams, their hockey teams. Women's cricket very strong with Colombo Coles. And also, I'll tell you what, there are a few who have played for those two clubs. They've met after 6 o'clock too. They're pretty known for that too. It'll happen Highly entertaining it. clubs. It'll happen whenever. There is uh, good rugby at uh, the adjoining Havoc Sports Club too. Neat cricket this. There's a point that I was making. The previous over the last ball, Kevin Koti got a bowled a pretty good delivery. And Vishad was on the front foot and dropped the ball in front of him and then still collected a single. Fairly heavy outfield, so it's not going to come to you at a bricks phase, uh, a pace. So the fielders inside the circle need to be very active, proactive rather, because you need to shut that area from that batsman, try to apply some pressure. At the moment, BRC fielders are at the edge of the circle. So every time when you drop the ball in front, you're going to get a very comfortable single. One change for BRC from the last uh, team. Danal Hemananda left out for Malindu Shehan. Scorers today helping us is Dinesh Kumara. Cole scorer is Claude De Silva. Dimitu Asanka is doing the job for BRC at the main scoreboard. It's a historic one of a kind scoreboard here. Another top edge, never mind. You will see plenty of sweep shots on a track like this. Like I mentioned, it's not the wicket that you can transfer your weight and play late simply because of the bounce and the slowness. PRC wicket is also pretty similar to this. So these PRC guys will know thing or two on a wicket like this, how to play. That's another sweep shot. Although he was beaten for speed, but that's a safe shot. Even from outside the off stump. So single to finish the eighth over. Coles being put into bat, 59 for two. These two batters are looking to establish a lot of work going for this uh, test training. Heavily used. 
Um, the ground secretary is Rangana Herat. The head groundsman is D.L. Susanta, but the curator is Susil Ananda. 14 strong staff. It's a good job. It's a superb venue. Tell me, you have some superb memories. Royal Tomei and 100 saved the big match. Is Malin Dushan, the man who came in 1 for 27. Just one wicket. Yeah, very good memories, uh, Maharita. Every time I walked into this venue. And also... Oh, another big hand here. What's that? This is all basically centenary match. Oh. This was a wicket where I, there was an equal opportunity for both batters and bowlers. Bowlers get an equal shot when he walked into this. They have their life on it. But once you get set, this is not a bad wicket to bat on. And also the um, outfield. This. There's one, grad, uh, one ground that had buffalo grass right around. That good old buffalo grass, we call it. Um, so the ball was travelling. It says Camelodon Cricket and Athletic Club. So I, mean, I believe in those days there would have been that 100 yards dash here. Popular sporting venue, this. They play their squash, their tennis. Bowling with purpose here, Malin Dushan. So Malin was the um, late inclusion instead of Danal, the left arm fast bowler from St. Peter's. Slightly slingy action. You might like this surface. Might get a couple to skid through. Four fielders inside the circle along with Deep third man and a deep cover. It's a very really strong offside field. There you are. That came at a comfortable height too. It's a bit of movement away from the track. Yeah, Vishad Rantika has scored 91 runs uh, through this season. Well bowled, well bowled. Idea is correct. Is it uh, 1 6 and 15 fours before this game? Look for two and get it comfortably. Will they look for three? Good sloppy Vikram Sanjay. Got there. Sangeet Kure 151 and Ravindu Rasanta 90 were the two top uh, aggregate uh, run makers uh, for Colombo Colts before this game. Both of them are out at the moment. Dismissed. Yeah, that's why this partnership is even more important. Going at a good rate, 21 of 24. Like I mentioned, Harita, I think this is certainly not a pitch where you are going to go hell for leather and uh, score 180, 200. This is... Again, missed time, full shot. But Obviously, uh, you need to you need to bat on, a, or bat on a wicket like this to gauge on how many that will be enough. And um, that's in the debate as well these days. In Sri Lankan mm -hmm. uh, innings, we start so well and then suddenly lose our way in the middle of the innings. But... Uh, Coming back to this game, I think these batters should have realized by now there is not enough speed on it and there is not enough bounce uh, to uh, cover all the angles. So they'll have a good look around and uh, I think 140 to 160, depending on the bowling attack you have, it's going to be a pretty competitive total. We yet to see who makes some rise. Have a ball. Running between wickets. I tell you what, brave running between wickets. Good throw, I had him. Flirted with danger, got away with it. End of nine overs. Colombo Coles put it to bat 64 for two against BRC.
I'll tell you what, Harita, you've spent a few nights and days um, at BRC Club in your life, and uh, good to see that they are back in the knockout stages in the domestic level. They used to produce a lot of good cricketers, didn't they? Yeah, they got in uh, ahead of uh, Ragama on a better run rate after winning four of the five matches played from Group B, BRC. Columbo Coles were unbeaten after five games and uh, they got in ahead of Sebastian Knights and Tamil Union. Rakam and Pangura were behind uh, DRC in Group B. Tilakaratna Sampat into his third over, just nine runs. That's his experience. Andu. He can bat at the top order, he can bowl here, he can keep wickets. Utility cricket like his elder brother. He'll be annoyed with himself, Dhananjay Lakshan. Well, if you want to play a shot like that, you need to get down on it. He is a bit too upright for my liking. Close, close, close. He is a goner. Sampat has struck. That's pressure. You get some tight bowling. Only a few moments ago, I just I was just talking to you, uh, Harita, about judging the bounce and the speed. That said, that said, touch low too. And he was his back foot didn't move that much, so he was playing while it's still spinning. On that occasion, it didn't spin, but it went with the arm but he was stuck on the crease and it kept low stayed down Dhananjay Lakshan what a wicket to have for BRC he's gone for 13 Coles losing that third wicket 65 after 9.3 overs Coming in at uh, number five, uh, Ashan uh, Dumidu has scored 89 runs uh, through this tournament. Is it nine sixes and four fours so far? So he's a batsman who could make a difference. Pretty experienced. Yes, Ampa deserved that trigger too, Arita. He's been applying some pressure, asking a few questions. On a wicket that gives him a bit of assistance, and this is how he picked it up. Dhananjay Lakshan, youngster, was beaten by speed and lack of bounds, as well as through the experience of Tilakaratna Sampat. Start him in front. The boy from Gurukula Kalani. Straight away off the mark. Poor, poor. Again. I think Sampath, as you can see, is raising a few questions from his teammates that BRC fielding has not been up to the mark. Yeah. This is not Mal a bad uh, ground to field, no, too. It's a very good ground to field. Malin Dushyan. Good rotation of strike. Vishad Randiga holds the key. He's batted for half the innings now. Probably he'll be keeping wickets too. So, Coles would want him to bat on. He's contributed quite well. End of the over. That's 10 gone. Coles are 68 for 3 after being sent in.
ලකුණු 68 කඩුලු තුනයි කෝට්ස් කණ්ඩායම අද දිනේ තුලදී උදෑසන සිට සිදු විශේෂ සිදුවීම් ඔබ මේ දකින්නේ පළමු කඩුල්ල විකුම් සංජයගේ පන්දිය වීම යටතේ සංගීත් කුරේ දෙවිගේ පසුව යම් කිසි සබඳතාවයක් ගොඩනැගෙමින් තිබුණා ඉතා ජාන්දික පහරවල් කීපයක් මෙල්ල කළා හොඳ පහරවල් නමුත් දඟ පන්දිය වන්නන්ගේ පැමිණීමත් සමගින් මේ දක්ෂ පන්දි රැකීම අප දකින්නේ දුවද්දී දවා ගැනීම රවිදුගේ අලංකාර හය පහර ධනංජය ලක්ෂංගින් පසුව හුදෙවී ගියා ටීම් සම්පත්ගේ පන්දිය වීම හමුවේ මේජර් ක්ලබ් T20 තරගාවලියේ පළමු අවසන් පූර්ව තරගය ක්‍රියාත්මක වන්නේ පිසරාවල් පිටියේදී අයිබුවන් සචින් අයිබුවන් අසංක සුබ උදෑසනක් සියලුම දෙනාට ඉතින් කෝල්ස් කණ්ඩායම අපරාජිතව තමයි මේ අවසන් පූර්ව තරගයට ඇවිල්ලා ඉන්නේ ඉතින් PRC කණ්ඩායම අද උදෑසන කාසීවාසී ජයග්‍රහණය කරමින් පළමු පන්දුවට පහර දීමට කෝල්ස් කණ්ඩායමට අවස්ථාව ලබා දුන්නා රවිඳු රශාන්තගේ දැවියාම ඊටමත් දැකුම් කළු අවස්ථාවක් බවට පත් වුණා මේ තරගේ තරගේ වෙනස් කළ දුවද්දි දැවියාමක් බවට පත් වුණා හෙදි දුෂාන් හේමන්ත ඊටමත් දක්ෂ ආකාරයෙන් පන්දු රැක ගැනීම තමයි හෙදි සිදු විශේෂ දේ අදත් ස්ක්‍රිප්ට් එකට ඇට ඉහලින් පන්දු ඇදි යනවා ලකුණු හතරක් කුමන ආකාරයෙන් පැමිණියත් ලකුණු ඔබට වටිනවා මේ ලකුණු හතර විශාච්ච ඔහුගේ පෞද්ගලික ලකුණු සංඛ්‍යාව ඉහළ යනවා ලකුණු 28 දක්වා ඔය අවස්ථාවේදී ඔහුගේ ඔහු බලාපොරොත්තු වුණ පහර නෙමෙයි නමුත් අපිත් ඒ ඉහළ ධාරයේ වැඩි පන්දුව හතරේ සීමාව කරා යනවා හානියක් වන්නේ නැහැ තමත් හොඳ ආරම්භයක් ලබාගෙන තිබෙනවා කෝල්ස් කණ්ඩායම පන්දු වර 10 කුත් පන්දු දෙකක් අවසන් ඉදි කඩුලු තුනයි ලකුණු 73යි ධනංජය ලක්ෂන් තමයි අවසන් කඩුලු ලෙස කෝල්ස් කණ්ඩායමේ දැවි ගියේ තලංකාර පහරක් නිසි කල්මැනීම සාර්ථකයි ලකුණු 4ක් විශාද රන්දිකට ඔහු කෙමෙන් කෙමෙන් වේගය වැඩි කරන බව පෙනෙන්නේ අනිවාර්යයෙන්ම සංක විශාද රන්දික අධ්‍යක්ෂීම් තිබෙන පිටිකරුවෙක් ඔහු මලිඳු ෂෙහන්ගේ පන්දුවේ මිතාමත් හොඳින් හඳුනාගෙන තිබෙනවා රවුන්ද විකට් ආකාරයට තමයි පන්දුවේම සිදු කරේ පායින්න පෙදෙසින් කෙලින්ම කවුකෝන හරහා හතරේ සීමාව වෙත යොමු කරනවා කෝස් කණ්ඩායම දැඩි විශ්වාසයක් අතතිව තමයි මේ තරගයට ඇවිල්ලා ඉන්නේ විශේෂයෙන් ඔවුන්ගේ මානසික මට්ටම ඉතාමත් ඉහළ මට්ටම තිබෙනවා ඔවුන් අපරාජිතව සිටින්නේ තව දුරටත් මේ තරගාවලිය තුළ BRC කණ්ඩායම එක් තරගයක් පරාජයට පත් වුණා මූලික වටේදී කඩුලු තුනක් දැවිද සිබිනවා පන්දුවර 10යි පන්දු තුනක් ගත වෙයි තිබෙන්නේ කෝල්ස් ඉනිමේ BRC කණ්ඩායම තමන්ගේ පන්දු යවන්නන් සංකලනය කරමින් උත්සාහයක් දරනවා ඔවුන්ගේ ලකුණු ගලා යම වලක්වන්නට කෙසේ නමුත් විශාද රන්දික හොඳින් පන්දුවට පහර දෙමින් සිටින්නේ නැවතත් එක් ලකුණක් ඔහුට මූලික වටේ අවසන් තරගය ක්‍රීඩා කළ කණ්ඩායම තමයි කෝල්ස් කණ්ඩායම වෙනුවෙන් ක්‍රීඩා කරන්නේ ඔවුන්ගේ කණ්ඩායමේ එකදු හෝ වෙනස් කමක් සිදු කර නැහැ අවසන් පූර්ව තරගයේදී නමුත් BRC කණ්ඩායම එක් වෙනස් කමක් සිදු කරලා තිබෙනවා ඔවුන්ගේ වමත් වේග පන්දු යවන ක්‍රීඩක දනාල් හේමානන්ද වෙනුවට තමයි මලිදු ෂෙහන් දකුණු තින් වේග පන්දු යවන ක්‍රීඩකයා අද මේ තීරණාත්මක අවසන් පූර්ව තරගයේ ක්‍රීඩා කරන්නේ ඔය පාවරණේ වදින්නේ ඉල්ලීමක් කරනවා නමුත් විනිසුරු නිහඬයි හෂාන් දුමිඳු අවදානමෙන් යාන්තම් ගැලුණ වගේ දෙයක් වසංක ඉතාමත් හොඳ පන්දුවක් එවර දුර්වල පන්දු කීපයකට පසුව කඩුල්ල වෙතමයි කෙලින්ම කඩුල්ල වෙතමයි පන්දු යොමු කරේ නමුත් පිටේ ඇතුළත ධාරයේ වැදුණා ඒ නිසා වෙන තමයි රෝහිත කොට්ටාචිය නොදෙවිනු පිටිකරුවෙක් ලෙස සංඥා කළේ මේ තරගයේදී රෝහිත කොට්ටාචිය සහ ප්‍රගීත් රඹුකෙල්ල පිනිසුරුන් ලෙස කටයුතු කරනවා අද දිනේදී නැවතත් මලිඳු ෂෙහන්
ඔහු උදාසන යම්කිසි වර්ෂපතනයක් තිබුණත් ඔබේ පහරවල් වලට නිසි වටිනාකම ලැබෙමින් තිබෙනවා යාර්ථයේ සීමාවෙන් එපිට හොඳින් වේලි ගොස් තිබෙන්නේ ඔහු සංක උදාසන කාලයේ තරමක් වැහි වලා කුලින් බරව තිබුණ අහසක් තමයි පීසරා ඕවල් ක්‍රීඩාංගණය අවට අපට දැක ගන්න ලැබුණේ නමුත් මේ වන විට නම් ඊටමත් තත්ත්වය සුබයි හොඳ කාලගුණික තත්ත්වයක් මේ වන විට වාර්තා වෙනවා පීසරා ඕවල් ක්‍රීඩාංගණය අවට ඉතින් අපි බලාපොරොත්තු වෙනවා දිනේ පුරාවටම ඊටමත් හොඳ ක්‍රිකට් තරඟ ක්‍රිකට් තරඟ සඳහා උචිත කාලගුණික තත්ත්වයක් දිනේ පුරාවටම පැවැත්තේ කියලා විශේෂයෙන් අද සවස තවත් අවසන් පූර්ව තරඟයක් ක්‍රියාත්මක වීමට නියමිතව තිබෙනවා යුද හමුදා කණ්ඩායම සහ සැරසන්ස් කණ්ඩායම අතර තමයි ඒ දෙවන අවසන් පූර්ව තරඟය පැවැත්වෙන්නේ अवबोध्य दुनियाँ ඔව් ඒ වගේම සංක පිටිකරුවා එතරම් විශ්වාසයකින් නෙමෙයි මේ ස්ලොක් ස්වීප් පහර එල්ල කරන්න ඔහු නිසි ආකාරව ඔහුට කල් මැනීම සිදු කිරීමට අවස්ථාවක් ලැබිනේ ඔබ කිව්වත් වගේ පන්දුව පහතේ නැදියා වේ කෙසේ නමුත් විශාත් රන්දික හොඳ ඉනිමක් දියත් කරා පන්දු 30යි ලකුණු 35යි ඊටමත් හොඳ ප්‍රහාරාත්මක වේගයක් රඳවා ගත්තා කෝස් කණ්ඩායම ලකුණු 82යි කඩලු 4යි ඒ වගේම සංක පොල්ස් කණ්ඩායම ලකුණු 82යි කඩලු 4යි පන්දු ආර 11ක් උත්පන්දු දෙකක් අවසානයේ නවක පිටිකරුවා මුදිත ලක්ෂාන් පිටියට අවතීර්ණ වී තිබෙනවා ඩී.එස් නානායක විද්‍යාලයේ නියෝජනය කරපු ක්‍රීඩකයෙක් දක්ෂ තුමිය වූ ක්‍රීඩකයෙක් නායකත්වය දරුවා ඩී.එස් නානායක විද්‍යාලයේ විශාල පහරවල් අවශ්‍ය මොහොතක් ඒ වගේම කඩුලු කීපයක් වැඩිපුර දැවි ගිය අවස්ථාවක් පොල්ස් කණ්ඩායම පළමු ඔව් දුමිදු ලකුණ ලබා ගන්න මුදිත තමන්ගේ පළමු ලකුණට තවත් රැඳී සිටි යුතුයි පිටි හෂාන් දුමිදු සහ මුදිත ලක්ෂාන් තමයි දැන් කඩුලේ රැඳී සිටින්නේ මුදිත ලක්ෂාන් නවක පිටිකරුවා තරඟ 14යි ලකුණු 644යි හොඳ හොඳ මිනිම ලකුණු 73ක් අසංක ලකුණු ලබා ගැනීම සාමාන්‍ය 49.14 තමයි තමත් හොඳ පිටිකරුවෙක් සාමාන්‍යයෙන් मेदपेल पहाल मेदपेल पिति कर लकुन साहिसे विशेष ඔය පන්දුවාරේ අවසන් 12 වෙනි පන්දුවාරේ තිලක රත්න දෙන 84යි කඩුලු 4යි කෝට්ස් කණ්ඩායම
Oh, uh, Pandey may come up to Venusak. And then uh, Malika Madhushanka. Ports can die. Lakunu Avashitave, the city name, Wagam Kadulu, Hatara Gavi, the city name, Kadulu, Hak, Pamana, you want to be in it. Vamat, Dagapandian, Malka. Ongi condemned city of Devana, Vamat Dangapandiana, doing the Gitarat and my Ongi Padana, Vamat Dangapandiana, Vagam Malka Tamai, Ongi Anik, Vamat Dangapandiana. Mudita Lakshan, Taumat, Kadula Talu, Titikarwe, Kevagima Dumidu, Taumat, Pandu Hatai, Rakum Hatai. Oh, as a Navastava, Kadule, Devatimata, Unna Menakiagi, Pandua, Kesenamu, Taumat, Mudita Madushan, Arakshitai. It ran Dagakarima Tibune, hey Pandu, Kelly Nedi, Pandu, Dagakarima, Balapurtuna, Mudita. Yalit, Sartak, Talukar Hadnoa, third man Kalapeta Lakunu Dekak, Emote di Muditata PRC Kandam, Tamangi, Pandu, Avanan, Venaskar Ganimin, Utsagan, sitting near Tavat, Ekadula, Tavagan, and the Vitu, in Apadakin, in Pahara. अब ऐसा नहीं होते दी तीनों ने करना पासु पादे का दोस तालुगर हरी नेट अब ऐसा पांडु दहाड़ टू लहातरे पहर देखा तो मने लगा के निम्न है कि आवले बुने कोल्स पितिकारुण एंटा पाल मोपांडु आर की पेट साप एक शब बीआरसी कंडे मुहंदी नेमता तारंगे टावती करने जीते बिना टीएम संपत्त करो बीआरसी कंडे वाकिन now that the Pitan at a sign, a pit in Pandu and Malka Yam Kissed and Gakarim could Labagan, and with the Tarjana Mogamaha, who gave Patite, Tava Tarama, the Diriata Gina Haki, Kissenamut, Nitik, Port Skanda, Sartaka, Pitikarna, Gina Kadulu, Tamayan, the Tibetan Loku Magatabu. This is a Tanga Punat in me. मैं तो काले पर चेदे उन तो मेरे नियाकारे निकला कि मैं देखा लगा कि ना मैं काले में ना करने के लिए बातें युती ओ वानी वारे मसंग का अडूमतर में पांडू वारा दास या क्या ना देख पत में सामान्य रूप में उन पांडू के पहाड़ की युती नन्दतुरु आवासन पांडू वारा हाथरतुला युती प्रहारे कटे या य Catch the excitement real time. Be up to date with it all. Let us capture your milestones. Get it sizzling hot off the turf. Hear the experts break it down. Dig deep into the nitty gritty. Be inspired by their greatness. Relive all the scintillating action. Oh, the hatter when he pandu are at a yapa pivis in me. Holds in me. Mushan Dumidu Samagin Mudita Madusha and Pitya Mada. Ashan Dumidu Saham Mudita Lakshan, then Kadulli Randi City in me. Passan Kadulla Benuin. Oh, what about us now? Sartakai. Sampad BRC can't die when I cut the other and vice out to this now with a free day cake. Tamat Honda Lakshan does come out of the city now. अगर मैं तीर्थ रात में संपत पीएम डिल्शन ये सहूदरे आ तीर्थ रात में संपत वो सहूदरे इन देवलम सहे ने खा ले अच्छे लोग काफी कर कर तसे वे लगा दिए थे वो ना पीएम डिल्शन उत्त जाते हैं तो तारे को लेने दिशा में करने में ताने तुरुवत अंतर समाज तारे को एक साथ आगे ना ओ स्लोक सुपार करुँचा ह� मैं देवन वारों पांडव तो बाहर देने बीआरसी काम दाम तो यहाँ किसी आकारे की मार्बियो गति है कि अनिवार्य में संकट तारमक काम की रोमांटिक गामी सब आवेश के वेन बावे पेन में तो तीव्र ने ये वक्त में दो इन दो तीन करातना मेहदी वेगिया वैडी वर्षों बाल का करना वारा इतना मत हों तो पांडव अपितु का रुआ तूल 
Perapandu to Sapek show very big Yakrandwag in a Pandu in the Sidukala doing the Hirakaratna, who make the Admakaran a Tung and a Pandu are a hoogie. Tavakayma, Nahapitaka Tula to Maya Dini Yami Pilima, Tibuna Pitkaru, Balapurtunata, Wada Vedi, Tatima Pandu to my Utsa here, Namut Avasani, Lakunakin, Tamangiante Marukaranda, Mudita. Itam udah itu untuk depan dia, mahu hundin kira tu dia nampi kita ruang dia. Dua lata sahaja daskam, namut tanah tiru ini lebih itu sahaja lebih nampak tenaga tanah. Tanah mak mandi kami tanah tiru, eva di depan dia pahat ini dia ni. Tak pun nampi kita ruang hukulai akta mai dengan kadul dia. Di situ ni bermat. Dengan depan dia orang hukulai akta mai antar dekian punya wasta di depan dia orang di situ ni ting. Tamat, khususnya ini punya wasta. पोल्स कांडा में में पांडुआर के पेटुल है कि ऊपर ही मामा टेमिन आंते अन होमा रुकर गाने में नेक हलाकुना ये वाके मलाकुनु देखा लगा के नहीं मिता मत वाटी ना दाहत्रों ना पांडुआरे आवश्यक पांडुआर टाटे कलाकुना कल बागन ना इतना मत होंदे पांडुआरे एक दो दो तिल करात ना किंग लाकुनु तू ना पामना ये पां Saya cakap tapi balam itu biar si kandang mereka sedih. Ini tarung awal ini awasan tu orang tarung yang tak kuat. Pemini kena. Awasan kau biar si kandang itu amat hundi ini tarung awal ini muli kebetulan awasan kara panah dura kandang mereka teri bela kuno hati lisan kerja kerana kelabak kata nugi gol teri bela kuno visi kerja kerana kelabak kata un rag makan dah mahamu ye paman ayah raja patu ni kardu hati rakin. Ita amat rasa cilau Marians kandang mereka. Tetapi halau itu Marians kandang mereka teri bela kardu atak kerja kerana ikut NCC kandang mereka teri bela kardu tu nuko kerja kerana ikut kelabak kata. Palamu pandu itu pahardi, tahun jagaan laba agen tiba no, dewanu pandu itu pahardi, jagaan laba agen tiba tiba no, biar si kanda ya. Nada slok si pahar itu sah he, oh, ekwarak pati tadi, nada tat pandu raka guna bahar kena. Sachin, metik metik tikar wan dedina kuda kena, awas tadi pandu visi ekak visi dekak tu ladi, ni mana betul, hatre pahar keluwi nih. Oh sangka, itu tamai. Khususat, muka dah meh, titik karuan di dina lagi. Wargaki mana belat berne, ni khadul lah raksa kerja na. Hei, ki upari mana laku nukum mana aku ada. Ama khususin pamduara dasin pasu. Apa itu bishal paharwal dekabala kerja ni mana awasta awal. Be, eva game anek pasin. Me BRC kanda me pamduan khususin malka eva game anek petin dua itu di lagar. Me wamat dangka pamduan nanti dina. Tama thundin pamdu dangka kau min eva game thana tiru itu bina mande gami sebab upiogi kerja ni min pamduan. Yang mana bawa ketamai peninan tibin. Oh, tetap. Laku nak sandha wasta, mudi tetap. Apa tu tuah? Pandu ari dewa ni pandu. Saya ni dengan kerja ini kita laku na. Samar itu, tanah tiru, tarumak vega tibin anam. Vega wad dengan kerja ini kita laba dengan kerja ini anam. Dua ini di akar ini pandu anu pandu anu. Tapi sesi ini, ama pandu, wadi puru dewa ni pandu anu. Tawa wasta wad tibin anu kadulu dewa. Kini ni pakai sesi namut. Ini tuh kon na ita mohon di pandu anu ini. Oh, alih tiup dengan kaki mana? Oh, tarama pain, pita ini ada tarama kepitin, wener sama imal ke mi pandu dahaing, bah bahu terayak pandu kiat nak kari. Piti karua tulat ayu mukaran roda piti karua ke ni betul ta? Wan ada sama roda imal ke? Wan never asar takai, modit dumi hashan dumi do kiat makai, dewan tahaye pahara, den den kiat makai nama call skandai mana? Oh saya nak wadah nama kehidupan tu pandu orang yang pita kata dengan kami, ni warga yang pandu kehidupan tiup ni dengan kami mereka lakukan apa itu orang namut, oh ya beli ke bahar kita, ini juga cara ha, kisah macam cakap tu kita teror, bishal lah bahar kita kerana ni pandu pati tu orang ini pada kita nak ayat sama ini bahasa, ini sangat kaya lakukan orang yang demi tu, lakukan pandu kehidupan kita pasu sama ini demi tu ni bahar kita keru. Mohon dengan agi sambil tahu itu lah, ini lakukan apa itu? Ini sambil tahu apa itu? Isi ekak tu lah, thamai wardenya bi. Tapi ni pandu arah pahala wakwa sana lakukan kasih kai kardu hatara.
Chino was completed here in the first innings. Coles have gone on to 101 for four wickets. These two, Mindu and Mudita, trying to put on a bit of a repair job. Every time it looked like Coles were getting away with the game, BRC have chipped back in with a wicket here and there. Right now, it's the two spinners in operation. Malka and Duvindu were the two left armers bowling. And uh, they've made life quite difficult for these two batters. Quite a few dot balls. Some pressure being built by, the, uh, by a big six in the last over. Slog sweep from Dumindu, breaking the shackles for Coles. And now Dushan will start his spell. Dushan Himanta was instrumental in uh, giving uh, Martin orders for Ravindu Rasanta with a brilliant pickup and return to fall uh, to affect the fall of the second wicket. And catch wow Dushan Hemanta earlier in the field with a superb fielding effort and this time because of his bowling his teammate repays the favor with a brilliant fielding effort at point a superb diving catch to get rid of Mudita how about that Haritha I think that was Dilan Jaila who held on to that the blind or oh, brilliant this is 2020 cricket at its best Sri Lanka Cricket and the Papra.com dialogue television should be very proud of that effort. Fifth wicket down for the Colts, 101 for 5. Super bowling change. Desired result is a wicket. BRC have been brilliant in the field today, a very good run out early on and now a superb catch there at point, giving Dushan Hemantha his first wicket and the fifth wicket for Coles brings in Akila Dhananja, the experienced Sri Lankan spinner, 97 matches has played, 2020 games, can hold a bat, can he Aritha? we've seen him play some big shots and right now Coles will want him to bring out the best. Average 86, strike rate rather. But I'm surprised he has come ahead of Avishka Pereira. It's his experience because of this. Good, good shot. He cut it away. It was in the air. I don't think he ever imagined that the field at point will grab it. That's time. Slog swept. Will it be caught? No. One bounce into the fence. In between the field at mid wicket and square leg. Nicely placed there by Akila Dhananjaya. So this is just the second delivery he faces goes for that big shot so the captain will take the responsibility this is experience very well struck pitched on his pads placement was superb his placement being the key word there could have hit it to either of the two fielders there but he hit it right in between the two again this time on the offside much better delivery can takes the edge take it to the boundary yes it does in fact an edge of Akila Dhananjaya's bat and speeds away to the boundary this outfield seems to have dried up now Haritha yeah it's a very good outfield uh, right good even Dushan Hemant has picked up six wickets through this uh, tournament and that really traveled quickly thick outside edge so his presence is felt now Rather, he went full over so far. There's been a wicket of a superb catch, a six, uh, a two boundaries. This will be the last ball. Yeah, 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 yeah. Choosing to hit that to the field that deep mid wicket and crosses over for yeah. a single. So the event full over comes to the end. 16 overs completed. Just four more to go in this innings. Let's see how much goals end up getting. For now, there are 110 for five. This was the Colombo Oval for all Ceylon cricket matches. Venue for the first uh, ever test match in 1982 against England for Sri Lanka and then uh, the first ever test victory against India for Sri Lanka. Sir Donald Bradman has uh, played here. 
And so has uh, Mahadevan Satasyun, a legendary cricketer batsman from Old Ceylon. So much historic importance and significance to this ground. 40 years since that first official test match for Sri Lanka. TM Sampath comes back into the attack and he's bowled him. He's picked up the wicket of Akhila Dharanjaya, the captain of the other end. And he cleans him up with his first ball. TM Sampath, years and years of domestic cricket experience and all it takes is one delivery to get rid of his posting captain. And... Uh, this is two good bowling changes from either end. He brought Dushan Hemanta, got one wicket. He brought himself on and gets another wicket. We as the spinners have been top-notch today. And as a result of that bold, Akhila Dhananjaya walks off just with the nine runs of five deliveries, 110. Bowls lose their sixth wicket in the 17th over. Surprising that the Umek Shamarais has not uh, been used by Tilakratna Sampat. No fault. We've seen uh, enough of spin. Yeah, the spinners have been successful. They, they've been able to control the scores. They've been able to apply some pressure. Been really economical. Sampat there are picking up two wickets for just 12 runs in his fourth over, in his last over of the day. We'll see how he chooses to finish off, whether it's going to be with pace or spin. I think Dubit is good to make, got one more over remaining. This is good bowling, very good bowling this, the business end of the innings, he knows exactly what's to be done here. Years of experience for TM Sampath. He's kept the pressure up without conceding boundaries. Into his last over, he's picked up two wickets, he's Forced the uncertainty on the batsman's mind. He's being very economical too. Good captaincy. Earlier you were on with uh, Garbani. You were talking about a decent total on this track. Before we talk about that, here's CM Sampath cleaning up his counterpart, Akila Dhananjaya. Looking to make room there, guided to third man, but too close to the body to be cutting. Still shorter by TM Sampath, pushes it away, the fielder, to the fielder at long arm for a single. You were talking about a Decent total being 130, 140 on this track. Colts might just end up getting there, but the way the pitch is behaving now, it seems a little bit more easier to bat. You still stick by that? Uh, you, you never know. The spinners of uh, Colombo Colts are also very good. That should be caught if the field is down there. Yes, in fact, he's dropped it. Wow, he judged it well. He got under it, but just slipping away from his hand. That is, that's a very rare letdown by the BRC, BRC fielders who've been superb in the field today. TM Sampath won't be happy. He could have been his third wicket. This was Dushan Hemanta, and he's one of the safe fielders. Take a look at this. You must make an effort to drop that. <laughs> Described in typical Harita Pereira style that. Right then, it dropped off, and then a single direct hit there, but that's when he's inside already. Good over by TM Sampath comes to an end. A wicket and a drop catch, 17 overs completed, 115 for 6. Of taking on PRC here in the first semi final of the SLC Major Clubs T20 tournament. And they've had a long tournament the last couple of months. All these clubs have been very busy. There were a few washouts, but Colts, this is how they've made it. They've been unbeaten in the entire tournament. They've won against Sebastian Knights by 17 runs and against Police, Nigambo, Candy, and Tamil Union. Some strong teams in their group, but they've been able to beat them all to make it here to the semi final quite comprehensively. Duvindu. Will finish his quarter now. And that's gone. 
That's another wicket. Dovid Tilakaratna using all his mastery to get rid of Nimesh Bendis who decided to get down, come down the ground and try to launch him behind. But completely misses it and the keeper does the needful. Another wicket for Dovindu, another wicket for BRC. This, uh, another quality bowling change by the experience um, Tilakaratna Sampat. Uh, he was really not there. Uh, looking to get the big boundary. Came out a long way. Misal Francisco, safe uh, wicket keeper there. That's his fifth stump of uh, the season. In addition to the two catchers. Image goes for four. Colts losing their way now as this innings comes to an end. 115 for seven. Catch the excitement real time. Be up to date with it all. Let us capture your milestones. Get it sizzling hot off the turf. Hear the experts break it down. Dig deep into the nitty gritty. Be inspired by their greatness. Relive all the scintillating action. Dovindu Tilakaratna has picked up his second wicket there, stumping. And that brings Avishka Pereira to the crease. 18th over in progress, calls are 115 for 7. They want to finish strong, BRC, they've been really good with the ball today. And the former Ireland captain, who's played under 19 international cricket. Coming very late. Looking for a quick single there to get off the strike. But this is good bowling by Dovindu Tilakaratna. He spread the pitch very well. Um, the highest score that uh, Colts have made uh, this uh, tournament, 211 for 7 in their 20 overs against Tamil Union. And I just played at BRC grounds. Far from that, his performance. In the sweep shot this time. I think that square leg just the cleaning up. Avish Kapera gets off the mark. And the two teams have made over 200 runs in their innings uh, this uh, tournament. The other one being Avi, who are going to be taking on Saracens in the second semi final, which will come to you live and exclusive on Papere.com networks, dialogue channel 140, and the SLC YouTube page. Once again, very nicely bowled by Dovindu Tilakaratna. His father, Hashan, is watching on from the side nets. You've seen him um, with the women's team who is practicing here at the PSR Oval as another tour of theirs gets underway. There you go. That's Hashan in the white there with the women's team. Where's Jamari Atapattu there? So a while back, hammering it away in the nets. Not sure where she is now. A decent tour of Pakistan. Lost a couple of close games. 1-1. Inside edge this time, another single, but this is not going to help Colts. They need big shots, they need the big ones, they need those sixes and fours to get their total to a very decent one where they can challenge BRC. 18 overs completed, just two to go in this innings. Colts are stuttering along at 117 for seven. These two batters have been top order players at school level, so they can really get going. Shanuka Disanaka, the Colts coach, he can't leave it for any later than this. They have to take a chance. They have only the last three wickets to uh, go for it, but they have to take it now. Here's an opportunity. Dushan Hemanta is probably the only weak link, if judging by what he has done so far. We want to target him, the leg spinner. Yes, he's picked up a wicket off a brilliant catch at point, but he did give away a boundary in the previous. So when this is the over, they'll try to go for a couple of big shots. Dumindu has been there for a while now. We want to go off the bowling. This is a good ball to start off with. Just a single there. So 118 now. 
the top order had to do the scoring and uh, they left at regular intervals at the uh, dismissal of Ravindu Rasanta with a brilliant effort uh, from the one on the pitch, uh, Dushan Hemanta created a little bit of uncertainty they never recovered from it very strong side indeed that's what BRC have done well every time it looked like Coles were stitching together a partnership and getting things under control Ooh, that's an under edge gone straight to the keeper might be in trouble if it's a direct hit he's an overthrow but the batter's choosing not to cross over looks like Francisco is in a bit of trouble there seemed like the ball hit him straight in that danger area around the groin the board Lahiru Samarkon let's try and look at what happened there as the first change Ooh, that hit him straight on his fingers didn't it I think can be really hurtful when it happens couldn't close his hands on time hit him straight on his fingers right, he's back up now this is good news for BRC then Looking for that slot sweep again. This time, I think it was an underage, and Dushan Hemanta picks up his second wicket. Dumindu employing that slot sweep once again, getting nowhere close to it from outside the off stump. And I think that was an underage straight to the keeper. An easy catch this time for Francisco. Dushan Hemanta's second wicket, Leo Francisco's second victim, and yet another good bowling change by Telakaratna Sampath. This has been a superb effort by the BRC spinners. They've been backed up by their fielders. That captain has done some amazing changes. Hashan Dubindu looked like the only guy who could have done some damage towards the end. He walks away 22 of 20. Colts are struggling at 119 for 8. Ronpal walks in for the penultimate wicket. Now, this is looking dangerous for Coles. They might just get bowled out if they are not careful. They'll go on to bat out these nine remaining deliveries, get as many as they can. And I love their bowlers, something to defend and outside edge this time. Dushan Himanta has bowled well. Imija Ronpal is a top order bat for Nalanda. And uh, he's a youth international. That was. Dushan Hemanta is a very happy man for that wicket. That is desperation on the part of the batsman. So now on the teammates out in the middle, not many balls remaining. Boundaries have dried up, uh, Samir. Big what, problem. What, what Dushan has done well here is not allow the batters to get under him generally. Most of these batters down the order, they like to get on one knee and play that slog sweep and that big shot. But he's bowled outside the off stump, which means they have to drag it from outside. Vinuja Ranpul is the batter who's just walked in. They have to drag it from the outside, which makes the effort all the more difficult. Left-hander now. Ooh, that's nicely bowled. That's very nicely bowled. Two overs then. Two superb overs by Deshan Heman, Dushan Hemanta. 19 overs have been completed, just one to go in these innings. Coles are struggling. 121 for eight. We've got one more over to go in these innings, and Coles, who have been so good so far in this tournament, they are struggling here in the semi finals against a very strong looking BRC unit. 121 for eight. So it will be spin to finish things off for BRC Malka, who will the left armer, who will finish things off for BRC. Two tail enders for Colts are the batters, Ron Pull and Avishka Pereira. Tail enders by no means, according to Haritha. That's been hammered. That's nicely hammered. That's right in between the two fielders, and it goes beyond the boundary line. We'll try and find out what the umpire signal is. He's making an inquiry from the fielders. And yes, it's a six. So just what Coles needed. 
Harita was telling us how these two batters, how these two players are good batters. They've been playing as batters for their school. And here they are. Especially Avish Pereira is proving himself. Another one, another big shot. Will that go straight to the fielder? Yes, it does. Reverse cup there by the fielder at long off, holding on to it. So Avish Pereira, after that six, falls. Kevin Kottigoda is uh, the one who held on to the catch. So that's his fifth catch uh, this uh, tournament. Well bowled. Not afraid to flight it once again. Can't blame the batsman. You've got to go for the big ones. Yeah, he has to go for it. Six of the previous delivery attempted the same thing. Slightly faster from the spinner there. Gave it some pace. A little bit more outside the off stump. But well judged catch. So this was the catch. Very well judged. By Kevin Kottigoda. Avishka Pereira with that six moved on to nine of seven deliveries. He goes, Malka gets the wicket, 127 for nine. Last man in is uh but this is Vinod Yarankul who had crossed over when the ball was in the air in the previous delivery. Three more deliveries to go in the innings and Coles have somehow racked up 128. They've lost Rafi cuts at regular intervals. There were moments in which they were looking good. They were looking good for a big one. But uh, every time they looked like they were settled, BRC kept picking up wickets. This is the last wicket to fall. Well, judge catch. He had to make sure that uh, he didn't overstep. And that's it. That's the end. Batage looking to go for a big one. But Malka cleans him up for his second wicket. And the last wicket for Coles falls down. We talked about how they looked like they might just get all out. And yes, they have got all out with a couple of balls to spare. This has been a very good effort from BRC, especially their spinners. Flighted up. Loving the batsman, tempting the batsman to go for that big one who had no choice, he had to go for it. It's the last couple of deliveries and he gets cleaned up, bold. So 128 is what the Colts have made. 130 seemed like the pass score here, Haritha. But will this be enough is the question that needs the answer. BRC will walk off with applause from uh, their extras. Right then, Sangit Kure, the man, dangerous man, was out early in the first inning, first over itself. Then that top order, 35, 21 and 22 from Vishad Rasanta and Dubindu. They were the ones who were the chief contributors to this 128 that they've made. But that middle and lower order, that's where the disappointment came for Cole CC. Falling prey to the spinners of BRC. Colts have been a strong side in this tournament. Remember, they've been unbeaten as they've come into the semi final. So they'll want to try and somehow allow their bowlers to defend this 128. Harita, what do you make of this total? Does Colts have what it takes to be able to defend this? They will have to, no choice. Four bowlers picking up uh, two wickets each, some very good uh, bowling changes. See, only three extras, that's good. Um, they have uh, not bowled uh, Umek Shamarayas. Despite seven bowlers uh, being used there, it was the captain who made uh, the initial uh, big impression. Dushan Hemanta picked up wickets. Um, also, um, a good effort on the part of Duvindu Tilakaratna. Whenever they were brawled in, they took uh, the right initiative, made sure that uh, it was good. Malcolm Adushanka also picking up a couple of wickets uh, in the end. So that is what is needed. Uh, there were some good uh, fielding efforts, but uh, there were occasions when their fielding was a little bit slack. But overall, it has been uh, a decent effort. The fact that uh, Colombo Colts didn't bat the 20 overs uh, would be of concern for them. They have thrown their wickets away. Nothing to take uh, away from the BRC bowlers who have stuck to their task. And very good captaincy, I should repeat, by Tilakaratna Sampat. Years of experience on his part, helping him make the right decisions on the field. 
Started off well with the wicket of Sangeet Kure. There was a four. There was a second delivery over, and then this this is what happened. Vikram Sanjaya shaping into the right hand, left hander, and getting that caught and bowl. After that, there was a couple of very good shots played by Ransat. Ravindra Rasanta. Rasanta. <laughs> Ravindra Rasanta, the former Sri Lanka under 19. Was lucky on a couple of occasions, but he did play a good innings. This was a run out. This was a run out that changed things. Superb effort in the field. This is what started the fall of wickets for Coles. They were 40 for one before that run out, and they were looking good. And thereafter, there were patches of brilliance, but the wicket started to tumble. Sampat uh, doing the needful. Whenever the ball was uh, spread around, they managed to get the ball to the boundary. But overall, it was a question of uh, not getting right on top of the bowling. And when the wickets fell, the pressure was on. Wickets had wriggled into That was also a brilliant catch by Dilan Jailat. Just when uh, everybody thought that uh, things were getting uh, loose, the yes, it tightened up. That was Akhila Dhananjay cleaned up by Tiragaratna Sampath. I was surprised he came in ahead of uh, some of the more recognized batters. So, two more victims for Leo Francisco. In the end, Cole's trying to apply those finishing touches. Weren't all that successful. Kept losing wickets, trying to play those big shots. You can't blame those two lower order batters trying to finish on a high, but in the end, it was the BRC bowlers who got the better of them. So 128 is what they've made, the Colts. This is the Pisara Oval, which is of historic importance as a defence. But here we are for the first semi-final. The Colts have scored 128. BRC will have to chase 129. We'll be back in a short while with that chase. Stay tuned. ಪಾಣ <laughs> real time be up to date with it all let us capture your milestones get it sizzling hot off the turf hear the experts break it down dig deep into the nitty gritty be inspired by their greatness relive all the scintillating action
நேரடி ஒளிபரப்பு யாழ்ப்பாணத்தில் மாத்திர கொட்டவில் கம்பியசட்ட இல்லை ஒரே real time be up to date with it all let us capture your milestones get it sizzling hot off the turf hear the experts break it down dig deep into the nitty gritty be inspired by their greatness relive all the scintillating action ஒளிபரப்பும் <laughs> real time be up to date with it all let us capture your milestones get it sizzling hot off the turf hear the experts break it down dig deep into the nitty gritty be inspired by their greatness relive all the scintillating action Hi everyone, Subha. 
Pudasana Kila Navatato Bos, Sadre Pirigana Pisara, all Kridangan, anything, Coles Kandama Saha, BRC Kandama Tarapatena, Palamu Avasan Pura Tarangi, Saji Vikashi Samagai, Navatat, Apio Bova, Pisara, all Kridangan, Pirigan, anything, Coles Kandama, BRC Aradan in Palamu Panduta Paharduna, Lakum, Ekasi, Siata Pamana. Labagani මට හැකියාව ලැබුණේ සියල්ලන්ම දැවි ඔවුන්ට පන්දුවර විශ්වවත් ක්‍රීඩා කර ගැනීමට හැකියාවක් ලැබුණේ නැහැ අසංක අයි බෝන් අයි බෝන් සචින් එතරම් පහසු ඉලක්කයක් වෙන එකක් නැහැ මේ තත්ත්වය යටතේ අපි දුටුවා තන තීරුව පන්දුව පහලි නැදි යන්නේ වගේම මන්දගාමී ස්වභාවයක් තිබෙනවා ඉතින් පිටිකරණය සෑහෙන අභියෝගයක් වන්නට ඉඩ තිබෙනවා Minisa, our staff, the Bino Coats Kanda, I met Tamangi Pandi on and Samagin Upper Mutsa, the Ranata, our son Pura Tarangak Misa, but a Yalita was Tava Klebin in Nehe, Sielu Varuda, Mitarange, Chaga Tutu, Osanka, own Coats Kanda, Mitamatunda, Arambia Klabaga, the Shishin Pandu, Arikol Haku Pandu, the Kakavasan, own Kadlu Hatarak Devi, Lakumasu Deka, Namutongi, our son Kadulu, Kepe, Itamat, Adum, Lakum Pramana, Katuluta, Devigia Vishin. Biar Sikanda Mitamat Hundin Tarangita Vati Runa Avasan Panduar Kipetula. Now Kapandion Namudit Lakshan, Wamat Danga Pandion Gintama Inima Aram Bakarane Palamu Panduim Harava Pahara Kela Karna Pandu Hatare Sima Pasukarana Mami Dang Yanu Biar Sikanda Ma Palamu Panduim Hatare Lakuna Club again Hongi Inima Aram Bakarna Tamat Subaram. Sarta Karam, that Palamu Panduin, Shishin, Tate, Salaka, Belly Medi, Maven Vita Tibina Tate, own Haki Taram, Palamu Pandua, Kepe, the Lakum Rascal, Utu, Moka, Tantiru, Mandagami, Sabah, Nisa Pandu, Parna one at a Parna one at a Pata, Pasu one at a Puru and Pandu, the Pardinata, Lagama, Pandu Pahati, Nadi, anything, Hippon in Rascal, Nasiru, Lakum, Pontavasia Kun. Anivare Masanka, Tilakratna Sampat, Sahamal Dushan Tamai in Maram Bakarani Saman in Ongi Aram Bakapitikaru and Yugule Tamai, Dilan Jela, Teva Gema Tilakratna Sampat, Namut, me Tibene Ilake, Salaki Ladaragena, own Yam Venesak Sidukar Tibena Oh, Dilan Jela Tamai, Maki Wataki, Dilan Jela Tamai, Ada Aram Bakar. Pitikaru wale sakrida karane Dilan Jalat sa tilkaratna sampat. Yano Dilan Jalat tamai palamu lakuno hatare pahar labagatte. Biar si kanda amar tawat lakuno ikasi usi hatarak pamanay awashwan. Tilkaratna sampat ki datyan vaisa urdu tisna vei lakuno ini mahatta ta lakuno dahaka ta vedi pramane labagne. Tibna river sui pahar manaram. Hatere Sima, but oh, a pit in Pandu, Fati the Venabava Tamai, Vinisuru Sanya, Karane, Rohita Kotachi, Yanua, Palamu Panduare, Mahaye Pahara, Labaga, no Tirkarat Sampat. May Dini to Uchita Pahara, Tanati Ru to Uchita Pahara, Kotora Gata, Sartakai, Hai Pahara, PM Sampat Gin, Saman in Napa, Meveni Pahara, Luge, Frida Divi, Pura, Madakatibino, Uge, Saudi Ravagame, it in Meveni Nimak, Tavat Idri Ragini, Amame Jack Granator. Itam to Halaki. The Lakshan, Tetaram Suba, Panduarak, Nemi, Kriatu Gavane, me power play, Avasta, Panduarak, Tama, Kriatu Gavane, Yarti Sima, Nepita, Pandu, Takin, and the Dinikistan got the cream at a hecky. Ilima Karanamut, Pine, the Epitin, Hadiana Pandu, Bautama, Peter Piniani, Kriatu Gavane, Sri Lanka cricket title, and Missing Sangi Danakur Labana, Pradana Tama. Antara samaja visa visa cricket taranga vali palamu awasan pura taranga. Ia dini di Sri Lanka kanda masaha Australia kanda matra payatuno palamu ek dini taranga payatuna. Tiye taranga gana tapi dini dikata karom palamu pandu arre awasan lakono dolhai kisivek no dibi biar si kanda.
नवक पंदुआरे क्रियात मकिरी में संधा दाना जेलाक्षान के अंदर आती बिनो तामत हों दिन पंदुए दोलने क्रियात में टेह की वेग पंदुए अवन एक दाना जेलाक्षान काल रिचमन विद्यालय निष्पादने वो अब प्रथम इन्हीं में दी दुतुआ कोर्ट्स खंडाय में देखो बीआरसी पंदुए अवन ने वैदिक वशेन दाग पंदुए अवन तमाय मुकद्द वेग पांडव कट पांडव का तपाहरण दी में यम किसी पहासुआ के अति सामाहर वेटर तानतीरो मंदगानी सुभावे निसाय वागे ना वेग पांडव आना टे यम किसी वेनस कम कल है कि काटस जावे है कि मध्य वेग पांडव आये है कि वे पांडव लिन ओहोट आते यम किसी वासिया काट कर गनी में है कि आरती बिना वागे में टीम सांपत � वाणी वार में संकल्प विशेषण अखिल दानन चेतना में कोच कांड में शिक्षण देखें बहुलतम धंगपंडियों ने वक्त में देखें बहुलतम पंडियों ने में डिलान जेलात के दत्त्यान इन्हीं में धारण करना भी है लखनऊ देशी है ये प्रहारात में कोई अनुभव के दशम पहाई पहाई होंडे प्रहारात में कोई वेगिया इसी प अंबायर ने लाखों एक से विशिष्ट नाबे किला क्या पांडु एक से विशिष्ट अक्तूल और नीता मत होंडे सार्थ कारण बैकला बागता फलमु पांडु आ रहे थे मुद्दे तलाक्षण टेरे ही वलाखनु दोलहा कला बागे दिन समाप्त होना वो फलमु पांडु आ रखी पे इतना मतीरनात्मक है पांडु आ रहे गाता भी में दी पांडु उठ बीएस कांडा एम में तारंगा वाली मूली के वाटे देख तारंगे एक पमने ही पराजित है पातू ने उन रागमा कांडा में हम ही पराजित है पातू ना और उनके कांडा में सामान्य में तारंगा वारे नित्य नायक या बाणु पराज पक्ष नामुत हो श्रीलंका जाति का क्रिकेट कांडा में जब तम जाति का एक दिन सांची जैसा समय के क ओ एवर इतना मत न्याना नित्य पांडव देवी मार्क वेग ये पहली लेसन मार डाल करा तिलकरात में संपत्ति रही व दानान जेलाक्षण ये तमाह इसी दुकान युद्ध वेग पांडव अवनन थाने तीरुए ऊपरी में वास ये लाभ आते हुए माध्य वेग पांडव काटे स्पांडव यावे में निदा एवर अत दुकान एवं न्यास्तावक दानान जेलाक्षण इसमें निर्यालय के डाकर दी ब्रेंडन कोर्ट को तारंग तीर कवर है आदि दिने श्रीलंका का बिहार को दक्ष खाड़ी लोरा की नीति करो ये वाकी में अखिल दाना जीता माय कॉल्स कांड में नायक आते दारा ने आदि दिने दी ये वाकी में हुए तारंग वाली पूरा आटम नायक आते दरुआ शानु का दिशा नायक तमा� तारंगे टपेर पैर तुल मूली के बाटे आवश्यक तारंगे दी खाटलू हाथर का दस का मार दक दक का आगे नहीं मर समातू ना ये वाला नया तात्व है कि आड़ा लगा रहे हैं क्या उन उपाय दुआ ना मुझे दुआ दी दवा के नहीं मर आवश्यक वक्ते बुनाया सार तक करके नहीं मर है कि आवक लेबुरी नहीं है खाटलू रखी � इतना मावदा ना पहाड़ किसी ना बुध पांडव आरे अवसान लाखों नो दहातु ना ही खड़ूल लक मदरी दिया सिकंदर मैं तारंग के पूरा वटा क्रिया तो कुन पालमु निलकुन पांडवारे क्रिया मत करा दाना जलाक्षा नितामत मुदी न हुए पांडवारे क्रिया मत करा आई थिंक अभी समग्र अपने में दत्त्य लबाद दिने दिनेश कुमार पे लखनऊ सटाहन करो आधे दिने दी मैं तारंग देख संधा नवक पांडु यावन निक्के दवाते बिना सांगीत खुरे Aku ni mau nu tarungi tek pandu arah kriat makara. Aku palu mupawa play awastah tulu datamai. Mau nu tarungi di pandu ayam. 
සඳහා කැඳුම් ලබා ගත්තේ හිතන තරම් සාර්ථක වන්නට අද දිනේ ඔහුට හැකියාව ලැබුණේ නැහැ පළමු පන්දු ආරේදීම විකුම් සංජය හමේ දැවියාමට සිදු වුණා ඉතාමත් හොඳින් කල්යල් මැණි බසා ස්ථානගත කිරීම කරනවා කිසිදු සමාවක් ලැබෙන්නේ නැහැ සංගීත් කුරේට මේ තමයි සිදු වේ යුත්තේ පළමු පන්දු ආර කීපයේදී දඟ පන්දු යවන්නන්ට එරෙහිව උපරිම පීඩනය යෙදිය යුතු පිටිකරුවන් ටීම් සම්පත් හොඳින් මේ හඳුනාගෙන තිබෙනවා අවශ්‍ය අත්දැකීම ඔහුට තිබෙනවා මෙවැනි තරඟ ගණන ශ්‍රී ලංකාවේදී තරඟ ගණනාවක් ක්‍රීඩා කළ ක්‍රීඩකයේ කාලංකාර පහරක් හොඳින් පිටට පන්දු ලබා ගන්නවා පිට නැදින්න ඔබ ශ්‍රී ලංකා කාන්තා ක්‍රිකට් කණ්ඩායම ගැන පවසා සිටියේ ඉතින් ශ්‍රී ලංකා කාන්තා ක්‍රිකට් කණ්ඩායමට ඉදිරියේදී තීරණාත්මක තරඟ කිහිපයක්ම පැවැත්වීමට නියමිතව තිබෙනවා අපි ඒ ගැන කතා කරමු තවත් පන්දු වාරයක් අවසන් ලකුණු 19 වෙනි සිවෙක් මත වී BRC කණ්ඩායම ृंगणी बल उदाह ඔව් අවස්ථාවට උචිත පහරක් තරමක් ගෝනේ රැඳි තිබුණා පන්දුව නමුත් ඔව් අතර සීම වාසන්න සිටි පන්දු රකින්නාට හරියටි පන්දුව මාවත හඳුනා ගන්නට යම් කිසි කාලයක් ගත වුණා ඊට පෙර ඔහුටේ හැකියාව ලැබුණා නම් සමහර විට අවස්ථාවක් බවට පරිවර්තනය වන්නට තිබුණා ඒ අවස්ථාව කෙසේ වෙතත් ටීම් සම්පත්යි ඒ ලකුණු හතර ඔව් එහෙදී නිමේෂ් මෙන්ඩිස් උඩ පන්දුවක් රැක ගැනීමට තමයි උත්සාහ කරේ නමුත් එය සාර්ථක වුණේ නැහැ ඒ අනුව ඔහුට උඩ පන්දුවත් අහිමි වෙ ගියා ලකුණු හතරකුත් අහිමි වෙ ගියා සහන උද්යෝගයක් නිර්මාණය වී තිබෙනවා කෝල්ට්ස් පන්දු රකින්නන් අතර ඒ වගේම BRC පිටිකරුවන් දෙපළ බිලන් සහ සම්පත් එයට ප්‍රතිචාර දක්වමින් සිටිනවා තමන්ගේ පහර වලින් ඊටම හොඳ තරගයක් 
अनिवार्य मसंक इतना मत होंडे उन्हें सुमतारण के देख बाला करने है कि अवलेब ही आप इतना दिन इतनी थिंग श्रीलंका खान ताक्रिकट कांड में दिल्ली दी इतना मत कार्य बहुत तरंग का काल समय आ इससे विषय तरंग वाली दम बोले दी पहले ने इन नाना तुर एक दिन तरंग वाली पाले के ले जाते अंदर के डंगे दी के आत्म गुरु में निमित्त आए एवर निमेश मेंडी सार तक आए होगी यातीन सिद्धू नू वार दे हो ये फांदुआ रे तुल मनीवर दिकर का नौयान हुआ तिलक रात न सांपात पीटीएन हिवात पैनवाला कु ये तमाय हुट काले लबादुन में उड़े पांडू रखा क्या नहीं मरा भी बालू मो ओहो इट असुदा ना मुआ कार एक मनी हाथुन आगत ता पांडू एक कुमन प्रदेश ऐड दे तमाय के ताकुनु पासट तमाय पांडू दमन कराने के ला खुद उड़े पांडू आ खुद इन रखा गत ता आवश्यक महोते दी ओ ये दी तारमाक दूर रवे की आड़ाला कर Keti pandu itu full kiri mak sedu karati lakukan sampat. Namun, nimesh men disewa daksha ganey udah pandu akhirnya kat teh hati si mawasa ni sita biar si palu muka dulu lepiti ni utara ti lakukan sampat. Lakon udah hati biar si kandai melakon usia hati ek kadul. Nama kapitika ruwa lahir usaha mereka on Dharma Raja Vidyale, adi sisik, adi kriket kriket, tuh usaha maning, meja pelak kriket kriket kijak nama kriket. Karena namut me biar si kanda me awasan tarik kipi pura utama, tuh angka tuh nistaan yang tama kriket kare, tuh itu amat daksh negiye na tuh ni rau kriket kriket kik wega pandu, wenu das kam dah kono wagi ma praharat me kapitika ruwa klesa das kam dekii me teheki. Oh, pada sakti mak siru rakti bina titik aruik. Dutu anak makian nata puluan. Bishal paharwal sahih tu titik aruik bawa tel lahiru samarakon. Tanah gatis dekak di prahar kewege tamai wajah katmu. Lakon datte kesiya panas tu nai dasma bindu ayeka. Ebagai mohon tu saman nak tiba no. Bisa bisa tanah gatat ayat. Oh, ni mau nu nesel tanah gawali di tita mat mohon kepi bina nada skam dekki mat samar tu na lahiru samarakon. Ever, piti karu lagi ni betul ada dua levelnya pandu, white pandu akhirnya sesanya kerana apa di tabuk ke level ini seru tu ma. Dewa nanti rekala kuna biu itu PRC kanda ini sesanya warni. Saya hanya tin piti karu ke mana itu pita tin, ke pita zaman itu hati juri nove pandu zaman kali. Calls. कांड है मलाकुन एक ऐसी विषय टकला बागा ता इलाके तमाय हम बायां ने लाकुन एक ऐसी विषय ना भी इलाक इलाके हम बायां ने बीआरसी कांड है ना ये वरा नया मत वारा वे की आड़ आला करें इन तमाय दाना जेलाक्षण पाम दुआ क्रियात में खरा ने ना मुत्त लाखानी आकुआ ने नहीं लाकुनों को तले बनवा � Be up to date with it all. Let us capture your milestones. Get it sizzling hot off the turf. Hear the experts break it down. Dig deep into the nitty gritty. Be inspired by their greatness. Relive all the scintillating action. ये दिन दिन श्रीलंका वाले ऑस्ट्रेलिया वाले तरफ पहले तूने पालम हो एक दिन तरह के निमावट पाल तू ना ये दिन श्रीलंका का अंडा मिता मातियों ने सटर नकला बाद दूना नामु थावासा नाम तले से खड़ लो देखा कि इन तरह के पराजित पाल तीन सिद्धू ना ओ ये दिन विशेष इतने में निम्न जेन मैक्सिलेगिन स Udah pandu, awasan pandu hari dia apa duduk. Kau tu udah pandu lagi mak ikhmanin. Nilai kerja kita kuman antek itu taman bahagian itu lebih tinggi. Kalau udah pandu lagi ni besar dah. Nimis Mendis. Kita makwan ni pasal apa pandu hari biar sih ini. 
संगीत पूरे तमाय होगे देवने पांडव आरे क्रिया में कराने वो पांडव तारा में खेती वे इल्ला करा दी साचिन इतना मोदीन पीते डे पैमिने नहीं है इतने पास हुए हैं पीते करवाने तो संगीत एक आता कि मुहूर्त आंधो रह गया नेता मत सत्रुदाय का नेता मत कुछ टाइ मैं तमाय योपर टीवी तो उन्नत दो तमांट समाहर विता आंधो हरी हटी लेबे नहीं है ना मुत खाडूल दवागे नहीं बर्तमान उन्नत दो युत अनिवार्य मसंग का यानु बीआरसी कांड है मटर थावत विशाल खाडूल लाख कहीं में यानु आलाहे � खोज कांड में पालुमु पाव प्ले अवस्था वे दिखा लो देखा कि देवी लाखों मुहाते लिस्टुना क्लब आगता बीआरसी पांडे और नंटे रहे हुए बीआरसी कांड में मत थारम को होंदा आरंभ या क्लब आगता नमु तोंगी खाड़ लो देखा कि लंगलंग बिंदु बैठना थी लगा रात में संपत के वक्त में दैन लहरों समर को उन्हें � उठात तरंग पास होने का अपने हमें थाने की रोमा तपिति करने देने टाप किए मिनटिया में क्या नहीं उषान है मंत्र सांत पीतर विद्यालय क्रीड़ा के मैं आवश्यक खड़ू ले देव देवियाँ म अकेले दाना चेहरा मिलो उनका लापे सिर्फ एक बार हम फांदू हो रहे क्या नहीं ढहके आवक लग रहे हैं नाम हो तो हो एक बार म पांडू रह गया ना उन्हीं पांडू फाती तक उठा तमाई पांडू यावान नाट ने तम पांडू रह करना क्रीड के आटे इल्ल करने इतना मत बैल गत खंडाय में क्वाशिन दवा का आस्था वक्त यंत्र पुलन ये वक्त में पांडू यावन ना के कार्डुल लक्की यंत्र पुलन समारे बीटर दुआ दी दवा के नहीं मोहटे मले बुना ये वक्त में होंडे होंडी ना अकेला दाना जे पांडू ने वट बार दूँ म या पाती तक कर पाती दिनों कर या वो नाम इतना वड़ा अपास वाला ना के बुना संगीत ओ तब तो पंद्रह रह कहाँ सं लखुनु इसी नवे एकार लो देखा ही पंद्रह रह पाहक कहाँ सं At the end of uh, the power play, Columbus Colts had made uh, 43 for 2, BRC 29 for 2. The second wicket on both occasions were run outs. Remember, Ravidu Rasant was run out. And now, Lahiru Samarakon run out. Dushan Hemanta, best score of 58, not out. Good strike rate of 125 almost. Yeah, good afternoon, everyone. The last over the power play, Harita. I think BRC will have to make the maximum use of this last over. Usually punched through the back foot. Akilatananje leading from the front. He's been pretty good on the field, too. Yeah, we moon we notice in that last innings. Um, as the ball gets older, it's going to get lower and slower, so it will be run making will be even more difficult. That's why it was important for BRC to make the maximum use of this power play. The averaging runner ball at this stage.
all of a sudden it has looked very different chamut battage is the bowler dilan jarat is uh, at the wicket 182 runs the most runs scored for brc in this tournament beautiful delivery done eh? nicely bowled perfect area nagging length as you call it nice carry to the keeper too because he's got a good high arm release and he's a bowler that will hit the deck rather than actually looking for there it is there's enough carry because the high arm release and he uses his wrist a lot both occasions dilan was beaten for speed not a lot of feet from dilan either he's stuck on the crease isn't he yeah if brc are to win they'll have to score these runs from the top order there's no way that was a brilliant bit of uh, fielding by the captain nakila dananja inspired leadership from him He never looked comfortable. Dilan Jalat. It is a superb comeback from Columbus. Yeah, three brilliant deliveries. The third one getting him the wicket. That's the result. Only two stumps. One has gone for a right. Magnificent piece of bowling. In a in a touch or so, we'll show the three deliveries. That's a perfect area to bowl on a track like this. Pretty often you'll see batsman batting outside the crease to try to meet it too, a bit too early. He is outside the crease, all right, but his back foot is inside the crease, so he's not looking to meet the ball early. See his feet stuck on the crease. Not a good technique to uh, have on a wicket um, um, like this. He's got some expression that kid, hasn't he? What a game. That's a good wicket to have. Jailat goes for seven. We are see losing that third. 30. In space of six runs, Biazi have lost uh, the top three wickets. Kevin Kotigoda, he can bat, but whether he can handle the pressure is another situation. So, a top score of 19 for the 23 year old. Strike rate 75 plus, nothing much to talk about. Coles will be happy to send him back quickly. Again, a terrific area. I'm quite impressed with this lad, uh, Harita. Semi-open action, good high arm release. Often uh, with these semi-open, open actions, you don't get that kind of a release, but he does. And this is how he got that third wicket. Beaten for speed, stuck on the crease. Even the two balls before that, the perfect area. Just skidded on a touch. Missed it completely. straight on this occasion end of a very very productive over penetrative over BRC 32 for 3 6 down Rohita Kotachi, one of four Kotachi brothers uh, serving uh, Sri Lanka cricket at the Premier level. There are four other brothers who have served uh, Sri Lanka cricket at Premier Division, the Ranatunga brothers. You have played with some of them? I have actually, they are well, how many? five, six, four of them played Premier Division. I'm talking about the Premier Division. Yeah, Premier, that's right. Yeah. Tamika was the oldest and then 
प्रसन्न अर्जुन प्रसन्न निशांत संजीव संजीव द यंगेस्ट Remember three of these Kolkata umpires: Rohit, Ravindra, Kapil, and the other. Great stuff! This superb comeback. Yes, he missing the services of Banu Karaj Bakshi, the regular captain. He had made 123 runs, including one of two centuries. We know the run pull is the new man in. We yeah, have seen some good performance from uh, from this kid. With Sri Lanka, we were up against the uh, Bangladeshi under 19. This wicket might suit him because he's he's also a half slinger. So he, the ball is not going to get up that much. So if he gets his length right, he'll be some he'll be handy on a track like this. We'll put pressure. No questions about that. Do you see? Lagging behind in runs and uh, losing one more wicket than their opponents did during the power play. Here was the uh, start of the power play. Yeah, Sampath. they flew off the box, didn't they? Uh, BRC, yes, uh, particularly Sampath. That was a clean hit. Went for maximum. Oh, and also they're running between. There's another hesitation. Well, there's another opportunity. It's all happening here at Pisara. Bit rusty. Coles and beaten up to now. Be looking to uh, apply the pressure. They have come back into this game in a big way. Throws, dives, the full works. And also, uh, Maharita Coles not depending, uh, depend, uh, defending a huge total. But it's a good total on a track like this, so they've got plenty of chatter going around. They are showing a lot of energy on the field, which is a requirement when you defend small totals. You need to stay in the game. So far, their fielding has been clearly uh, on top of their game, and uh, they have a, one thing that BRC uh, like uh, league two runs in there on the um, yes. particularly the outfield. There was one uh, brilliant run out effort, but apart from that. They looked a bit uh, sloppy on the field. Not so cold. They know, as you said, it's a low total to defend. They've got uh, a sniff uh, at their opponents now. This man, Dushan Hemant, uh, will have to bat through if uh, BRC had to have any chance of getting to this total. Not so good to see Akhil Dhananji having a slip in place. Very easily, when you're defending a total like this, Harita, you tend to get carried away and try to be defensive. But uh, good captains, they keep their nerves and um, try to pick up wickets at every given opportunity. Nancy is looking for wickets. Nearly created another opportunity. Dot ball to finish the seventh, 35 for three. Catch the excitement real time. Be up to date with it all. Let us capture your milestones. Get it sizzling hot off the turf. Hear the experts break it down. Dig deep into the nitty gritty. Be inspired by their greatness. Relive all the scintillating action. So they are still falling back, and uh, it is asking where it goes to eight runs and over. I think Cole should have done extremely well, and they'll hold that pressure on their opponents, their neighbours actually at Avalok Park. Good game of cricket, Sri Lanka cricket, major clubs, 2020 championship, 2022. The first semi-final. Yeah, kudos to um, the Papari.com along with Sri Lanka Cricket, powered by Dialog.
giving you every, every opportunity to um, see these cricketers in action, whether you're international, whether you're it's a domestic, whether it's a school game. One of what uh, Sri Lanka A is replying to Australia A at Thambantata. Kotikota doing the right thing, he's uh, rotating the strike. They'll have to get hold of a situation, put a partnership of 2024, 2025 rather. There was a 24 run opening stand. They need to get that confidence back. The wicket of Lahiru Samarkon could have hurt them badly. Thank you, Samir. 95 for three. Again, very well bowled. It's mighty difficult for a batsman when you don't have, when you don't have speed on the track. How to adjust your bat speed, Aritha? It's a it's a skill that you need to have, but it's not as easy. It's easy for us to say it from the com box here, but uh, these are not the easiest tracks. Dinesh told us the stats guru that only well, five boundary, five fours, and five sixes in the previous innings. It might be easy to hit a six down or four actually on a track like this. So the asking rate is 7.36, is what I was talking about. If it gets to eight, psychological advantage. Uh, Cole started off very well. Dhananjay Lakshan's maiden over um, gave a hint of what uh, they want to do as far as. Uh, the effort is concerned and uh, for sheer effort on the nets, you can't uh, match Akhile uh, Dhananjay's uh, commitment. Yeah, Dhananjay himself will be a major factor when he gets the ball in hand and as you know, there are plenty of op op options when it comes to bowling. They, have, they? they have a whole lot of them. The good old swing and hope for the best. This guy is not a uh, regular top order bat. So dot balls will uh, serve uh, Colombo Cole's course. Yeah, he's been terrific so far. Last ball of his second over, one for six, his figures. Again, another dot ball. These are not going to help BRC scores at the moment. Plenty of dot balls, goals, right in this game, in this game although they are de defending a small total. 38 for three after eight overs. Great uh, situation this. And, um it's the Group B points table that um, see Ragam also had four wins. Panadura had four wins out of five games, but uh, BRC sneaked through on the uh, better net run rate. Having lost to Ragama, Ragam will be disappointed with that. Yeah, not much in it, is, it, is there? Just point four in it. See at the bottom, NCC and Chilaumerians. And so is NCC. Just one win of five. That's been picked up. One bounce to deep square leg boundary. That's not the length. Because that's far too short. If you bowl that length, it's just going to sit up. And batsman will have enough time to go square of the wicket. So boundary early in the over. This might be the over that they'll look for. Look to get some momentum into this run chase. They have to do well. Probably his lack of experience, Vinuja Ranpol. Dushan Hemanta. Somebody who is uh, not a great basher, but uh, he could clear the boundaries. Is it six sixes in the tournament so far? Beautiful piece of batting. Single followed up with the boundary. So five of two deliveries, Haritha. Like I mentioned, this might be that over that they look for. Eight, nine runs per over. Runner ball will get them what? Nine runs. And. Kevin Kotigad also, we know that he is a very capable striker of the cricket ball. Dushan, 11 of 11. So Kevin will have to join the party. He needs to be proactive because you can't get this run rate above eight runs if you want to. Okay, this is a very difficult. That's perfectly hit. Very, very well fielded, fielded too. Brilliant stuff. Right. 
very quick on that occasion udit lakshan backward point there's a quality all round this that's the difference kalambo goals Oh, there it is! Brilliant stuff. That's the off cutter. You mentioned the word brilliant. Extraordinary effort. See that delivery, off spin, and it purchased also on the surface. You've got to be careful. You must have the technique to play this sort of uh, situation. To play the pressure situation. Didn't think Kevin Kattugada was uh, exactly there. Pasan Manasinga took a chance, promoting him at the top of the order. I don't think uh, it worked for him or for his team. Long walk back to the pavilion. Only the three runs of nine balls. Forty-three for four beers. Batsman is uh, the wicket keeper. He could also open Leo Francisco. Experienced, he's not uh, one of those uh, big strikers of the ball, but could rotate the strike very well. And also a left-hander replacing a left-hander, which is important. So this is why I thought that uh, Leo Francisco would have been a better option than Kevin Kotugada. These are his stats. Average. 13.05 we'll look to improve on that decent strike rate gets behind that one it's been a very productive over from Unijer Ranpol and also what I've noticed uh, Harita is that Poles are pretty united and they, they've got a spring in their step haven't they they are picking up wickets as a result too Beaten, beaten for that lack of pace, played across it and all over it. Kevin got to go. Did you hear edge towards third man? We'll get him a single. Leo Francisco gets his innings underway. BRC have got a long run chase ahead of them. Nine overs, four four for four. the excitement real time be up to date with it all let us capture your milestones get it sizzling hot off the turf hear the experts break it down dig deep into the nitty-gritty be inspired by their greatness relive all the scintillating action Getting into the uh, knockout stage, the semi-finals, uh, Army and Colombo Coles were the uh, unbeaten teams. Army is up next. So if uh, Colombo Coles win this one, they will get into the final in two days' time with a clean sheet. Yeah, good that you mentioned, Harita. Don't go anywhere. Locks the channel in. That's going to be a cracker of a game. Saracens do have some very good players when it comes to T20 format. And obviously, we know how well Army is going at the moment. They're unbeaten too. This will be an interesting contest. Left arm orthodox spinner Mudita against a left-hander Leo Fonseca. Leo Francisco. Leo Francisco. I should take correct. I should correct that. So the, he's got four fielders on the offside against the turn. Five on the onside. Two inside the circle. That's a good speed. It's got a good height. So he'll be looking to deliver the ball downwards rather than getting that ball above the batsman's eye line. Anybody? 
Bowl, bowl the first over and went for 12 runs. But this is a different situation from where he's being brought back. And also he has adjusted his speed a little bit. Great stuff. Sisil Lananda preparing a decent track here. It's the curator. Played his uh, club to cricket for Nomads. I'll tell you what, we were talking about Cole's fielding. If you have played against Sushil Anand, uh -huh. you would not take a chance on his fielding. Exactly. He, he was just a gun. He was, he was a cracker. He was a small dynamite, he was. Yeah, yeah. Very passionate about his work. All the short ones are good fielders. Speak for yourself, Gavini. Bye-bye. <laughs> Dusha Nemanta goes for a walk. And he'll have to continue walking. A yeah, questionable shot selection. He was looking to play against the spin. He was front on, so it was a difficult task to adjust his hands against the turn or to play with the turn. Have a look at this. See how he approached the ball? He was front on, back foot all over the place. So he just couldn't get his hands adjusted towards the spinning side. Take nothing away from the bowler. Good ball. Superb bowling change too by Akila Dananja. He's not brought himself on yet. Good captaincy. DRC in all sorts of trouble at 5 down for 45. Last stroke, Dushan Hemant. Almost a runner ball 12 for him. Vikram Sanjay is the new man in open bowling. He could clear the boundary, but uh, it's a tough ask for him. The top order has been sent back. Top score of 16, not out for the 30 year old. Brilliantly bowled again. Not the highest release you'll ever see. The trajectory was lower. Looking to Dart that ball towards the right-handers' pads and he's getting some perch and it makes it double difficult. See where he's released from? Yeah, like you said, Vikum Dananja, we all know that he can strike the ball pretty hard, but this is not the wicket that you can come out and do that straight away. Tushan Hemanta, all at sea. Tushan Randika, no mistake from behind the stumps. The moment he left the crease, he was in no man's land. He knew the danger, couldn't adjust. It was 68 for three for Colombo Coles. It's uh, 47 for five for BRC at the halfway stage. These are which started the Vyazi's uh, reply. They caught off to a decent start with uh, Tilakarate Sampat in particular. Getting hold of uh, loose bowling. He was adventurous over the first three or four overs. When uh, this happened, it started uh, a, a rot. Vyazi have still not uh, quite recovered. This was a brilliant uh, bit of uh, recovery. That got uh, Lahiru Samarkon dismissed. Never run off a no ball. This was uh, Dilan Jailat. The uh, wickets were falling. Kevin Kotigoda. The last man was Dushan Hemanta. Nick, 
Latsisi Pudumak Novi, Oge Anikut Pandion and Silu Dinamo, Tamahundin Pandio Minina, Daddy Pedanak, BRC Kanda Mahamu. Then was Ankaki again with Dakshap on your next Sri Lanka. Dinner is South Savis again at Angara to him, Ridakar and Kuidagi. ඔයාලා Vasan Mahatarangi Karai Kadiak Tibet Nigel began to go. Tam Hundabanduare, Panduatra Kavatama, Kisula Kuna Clubadi in Hakil Danja Pandu Hatarak Bot Pariwar to the Venema Lakun Rahita Pandu, Pandu Paha Pandu 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 Evarat, City Party, Novi, Paradi, and Kissy Namut, Hakia, Pitikar, and Ladima. Oh, me, what to me? Oh, Akila Tana, come up to me here at the moment. Never asked how to be. Even like Sidi Nokali to Tibuna Kissy Namut, Tekolos and Pandua, Etam on the Pandua, Laku, Deca, Pamana, Labuni, Eat, Balapur to tradition, Novi, at least Nami, and Kabu Pai, BRC, Kandaima, Abuja, Meta. Panduar Namega di Tawat Lakun Hatta Namek Kosha BRC Kandamada Sanka Tan Masiru Diga sitting become Sanjay Salio Francisco Pitikarwan the dinner Sahina Paswa di Kunta in a good lady matter Kalak Neh our shipikar one how do you devi go stigina I wagim up at the Danagan Laguna a pay Lakun Satan Kabinish Tera Panduare di Labagat Lakunu Deka Tama Yon Me Tarangi di Labagat Palamu Lakunu Deka Lakunu Asta Tama Nai Kung Hai Kya Labla Tin Labagan Me Dhanne E Mana Api Mungan Na Pandu Yavi Ma Koos Kaan Naim Gaam Na Honda Pandu Yavi Ma Pandu Yavi Ma Pandu Yavi Ma Uta Lakshan Amma Daksha Tungi Yavi Ma Pandu 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 Yavi Francisco, Ekmanin, Diviana, Tawat, Lakuna, Kote. Nata, Sudanam, Lakuna, Pana, Varta, Kirimi, Di, Laksisi, Kots, Kandam, Hai, Paharwal, Tuna, Hatare, Paharwal, Deka, Tuni, Avastava, Naka, Eva, Gena, Deki, Avastava, Hatara, Pasu, Kote, Tuna, Namut, Biasi, Kandam, Hai, Paharwal, Deka, Hatare, Paharwal, Tuna, Tuni, Avastava, Nehe. Daviyamak, Sartakai Mudita Navatat, Vikum Ge Kabula Deviyanova, Vikum Sanjay, Ohut Asartakai, Main Mutula, Miyavastava, Navatat, Coach Kandayamata, BRC, Avasan Pitikarwanda, Pitiyata Ginaimata. BRC Kandayamata, Lakunu Panas Ekai, Kaduhayak Devi Mewanuita, and then the Meila Ketama Asiru Ila, Kekbaad Patenova, BRC Kandayamata, Prajit Coach Kandayamata, Itamatma on the star of sitting name. Pandiyavan Sima in Tarmak at the Pandiyavan in Vidita. On the corner at Labagan, Titikaru, Kadula, Tulutama, Kiseta, Vikum Sanche, Daviana, Lakumu, Dekakata, BRC, Inima, Kadulu, Hekata, Lakumu, Panas, Eka.
दुवंदु तिलकरात्न नावक पितिकारु BRC कांडायां वेनुएन दुवंदु वमात दांगपांदियावन नेकु हटियोट होच्स कांडायां में BRC कांडायां में नियोचिने तेले नेवार होगे वागकीन पितिकारु एक वशेन कांडायां में � नेवन यावस्थावन रैसा खालमना करने का रहता दक्षिण पितिका रोचोल का वे मध्य पर ही तो इन दूर दूर तक है कि द मैं अभी होगे बाहर के न पीर ने बारा के न इन्हें इधर के ने आमतौर अभी बाल मो दूर इन दूर में तक दक्षिण पितिका ने दस काम तारा के दास एक दी होगे दस काम रात में बोलती बिना Oh, that's not good. Good luck, Shani. I'm going to go to the next one. I'm going to go to the next one. I'm going to go to the BRC. I'm going to go to the next one. I'm going to go Pasal kesitu narbanu, ini ada puluhan taman ke putar ke piti karnya daskam dua indu tidak keratnya. Piti piti karnya itu sudah nama cerita ni. Hasan memang hote di Sri Lanka kanta kanda, mata puluh kali ten taman ke daya kat ke laba di minci tinne. Pisa rawol piti di ni. Kali lembah ni India kanda yang sama ke tergawal sendha. Kena metu sesudah tinne Sri Lanka kanta kanda ini. Akhirnya dalam jenah utat. Tunggu di sini. Tapi mana dagang kali ini mahal ni kerana kan? Oh, itu am udah main sini ni courts. Pandu rakin dan sah pandu jawan kan? Oh, na sah na sah lu. Ini lu tahu kerumin pandu rakin ni. Oh, hendak ini mak, Dewi amak. Hatta ni kadul la Dewi anwa. BRC ini me dua indu tiada keratnya. Sweep pahar kerut sah kali. Namu pandu pade Dewi ini. Lalu asal kerana kita ni sweep bahar kerana kita ni kesel buta awas tawa club ni aneh. Tapi ya legs pin pandu ke awas tawa dia kira dah nanti lagi. Dua tiga kerat dah. Ek laku nak kerja dewi anu ayanu B R C kanda yang nak kuku panas tegai kadulu hati dewi. Si kandang pandu ardu lah, pandu dekat kawasan ini laku panas dekai kandu hatak Dewi. Dua tiga kerat nama dia sulung hatak dekat pada Dewi Gia. Mal ke Madu Shankar, nama kita dekat ruh. Wamat dengan pandu awan na biar si kandang ini. Oh, tak baru nama kita kerana warga kima. Bisa labih juga laksi si. Apa so labih juga? Nih ya. Oh, apa so kita kerana ruh. Dat teram kita kerana ruh kita uci kena. Kese nama kita kot kandang. Taman ge. Gatter, bel nanti kami odin sini nama BRC kanda ini. Antar masa kita ni BRC pasu bel pilih kerana antar masa kita ini kerana kita antar mana? Kalau yang mulai pilih pilih kerana masa itu guna di ni dia wasm mood edi. Kalau mahu edi, kita mahu ding pilih kerana BRC kanda ini. Oh, awak sam kadul itu dekat apa meh dah kini? Me pandi awan nan kadul itu lalat mai pandi awan ni. Pilih kerana antar ni dah se pahar di ni dah dini nih. Ya, thama ini ni ini ni, khususnya coach pandu awan nan gen. Bagi ni thamu tiruin mana sahaja kunci la, benua mande kami thamu tiruak dagat kayu mati benua. Maka arakshit itu pilih gan ni, akila dah lanchi jat yang teradat ini mati pandu awan ni. Oh, tapi ini awasan titik karuan terpahar di mana sedu itu benua ni biar si kanda ini. Bagi masa ni benua awa ipil thamu kali pakui dah keru pandu awan ni akila dah lanchi kian ni, mumbai ni sekarang ni ngosu ni kara. Oh, itu thamu mau kunda pandu awan yang asta ini. Tawat kadul lekat asan nama wasta kanu dah tu melipat dua hari ni mampat tema BRC kandai malaku lu panas dekai kadul hatak dewi.
Lakun panas dekai kadulu hatai BRC kandai ma daddy abhiyogya kabhimua o lakunu ekasiya visi atak ilakya khamba yanne. Namut panduara gaha tuna kawasan nati bina watawat panduara hatak pamana yon pati benne. Lakunu ekasiya visi atak ilakya sapura gani. Bata sangit kure nevatat kenda wati bina wapandu yavi muta lakun atin pita danda pandu yavanna. Ohu dua di dawa gani muka pita mohudin taman di daya katya sape huwa. Palamu kabulu kipaya tulata. संगीत को एक बीत कर एक बीत रात दिले दिए तरंग देख के लोग है क्या वक्त लग रहे नहीं नमूत अंदर की विंस आप अंदर ये भी में वो गिदाय का त्याग देने दूंगा बाद में ना कोई स्कंडा में नहीं वश में आवश्यक पूर्व तरंगे बीआरसी कंडा में रही हुआ मालक है ना वह तत्त्व तेरे का नांते ताऊ मत लाकू मिल Lahir usaha mereka untuk dawa kerana mereka dapat kuda sekali. Tanah hari ini pandu, nampak gerhana kelak sama ni. Pandu orang ni kerana awak sama maga hari ini. Ubah mata hari itu pandu baru dulu naik. Kalau kita nak kerana tanah pas swim kat timur orang yang asal ini, malak yang nuh tamang ke pertama lah kau laba gan nuh pasal pandu ini. Asal kami perayaan pandu arah ni, lakukan pandu arah kadul laksa ini dalam hendak pandu arah kat leh daran je. Oh, ini ni ada kim sahita pandu orang ni kau kadul lak. दवागत सेनिंग तमंगी अभियोग के तवा तवा दैडी करने पांडे अवनिक यहाँ बता एक लाखों ने कुछ साहेब नमूद अवस्था वक्त नहीं मैं पांडु राखी नंगे उद्दा में आता है ना लक्षी मैं विस्तर विचार का ताले टाटा टाटा है ना उनके तरह मुद्दा में इसी तरह दिखेल यानी एक मार लाखों ने कुछ साहेब पांडु न खाड़ूल ले पांडू वे दुना नाम अनिवार्य में देवी आमा को आने दी बुना इतान मासन नवस्था वा कसंग हटे वे निकाडूल मंगता ने देवी आन नॉन में न दी बुआ वस्ता वा मुक्तास नवन ताई वारा पितिकरु तने पांडू राखी ना टा वस्ता वा क्लब में नह पांडू हरी हट लबा गान नेट में तमाय संगीत कुरे के विशेष Tanya itu lagi na, kadul lebih dekat na. Ini tamai lahir di kadul lebih dekat. Tawat laku nak mal kete. Sangat kerumah dan dalam daksha kerja ke kasar kami dengan permata gaya hujung Sri Lanka test kan lemi sanji tiada pada dua ribu tiga ratus tiga puluh satu tahun kedi. Tama ti tama kundi Sri Lanka alun pelak dalam dalam itu dah kerana kerja ke sangat kerja ni. Kelakuan kerap hati maru ini anu dah hati orang bandu ini maru patenah biasa kan dah melakukan upaya satai kan luha tak dewi. Lakukan panas satu ayat kadulu satu ayat palus seni pandu arah itu. Apa pilih seni? Nampak tak? Aki ladana jessu dah nampak pandu. Ia macam ni. Apa dah kini? Metara gawali. Lakukan satu hari. Udah pandu agde. Ili mak kerana apa? Wini suru nampak tak? Sandaan kerana ni. Noda bi ya mak washing. Aki ladana je. Adun lebih tua termai pandu awan. Oh, pandu yang belum itu tak tihelin. Termai hati hi pati terawan ni. Alangkah na, alangkah na. Oh, eva tarak meh asta ayat dia. Okey, ni anu Dewi anu ma Dewan kadu le dawa gan na meh asta ayat dia kira dalan je. Atta meh kadu le Dewi anu ma asa ke biasa ikan na itu akan lebih baik. Oh, awas tahu lebah dulu na pandu yang guna itu musuh kerana ini nampak harga kita yang ni kira. Eh, abu oke Leo Francisco Baragan na namut. Pandu rakin ni kusiti nawa itena. Nimesh Mendis, hoge ata tamai udah pandu. Kisidu apa hasil kini toro raka gan nawa. Aki le dana je taman ke dewa ni kadul le. Ni dawa gan ni ada di ni tuladi. Tawat piye rakin awasan mahataran gate langai court skandai ma. Leo Francisco dewi ana titik karu lakunu nama elabagat ke panas hatai kadulu atai BRC skandai.
තවත් කඩුක් දෙකක් පමණ ඇතුළු තිබෙන්නේ BRC කණ්ඩායමට බුදි බුදි කරගෙන ඉන්න සම්මාතන්නේ කඩුක් දෙකක් දුරින් සිටින මේ වෙන කෝස් කණ්ඩායම ඔව් නාක ප්‍රතිකරු පිටියට පැමිණෙන්නේ උමෙෂ්ක මොරයිස් ඔහුට කළ හැකි දෑ ඉතාම අල්පයි නමුත් ඔහුගේ දස්කම් ගැන අපි යම් කිසි අවබෝධයක් ලබා ගමු එතරම් කතා කිරීමට දෙයක් නැහැ පිටිකරුවෙකු වශයෙන් ඔහු පන්දු යවන්නේ කණිවාරෙන්න ඒ අතරතුර තවත් ලකුණක් ලැබෙනවා මල්කට මෙන්න තවත් අවස්ථාවක් අකිලට තමන්ගේ කඩුලු දෙක තුනක් බවට පරිවර්තනය කර ගන්නට මොරයිස් පළමු පන්දුවටයි සූදානම් වන්නේ පන්දු තුනක් තිබෙනවා කඩුලු දෙකක් ඉදිරියට තිබෙනවා अलंकार Disappointing effort by BRC. They must have gone in in that halfway mark, thinking they've done a good job by restricting the Colts team to 128. But at 58 for eight, they were looking back and thinking our batters haven't really lived up. 71 needed of 30 balls, and Sangeet Kure comes back into the attack. Malka and Morais are the two batters here for BRC. Been a disappointment for the club from Havelock Road. Good afternoon, Samir. Yeah, I think the writings were on the wall once that power first power play finished. Gap in the chance, comfortably taken. Made it look easy. Tananjay Lakshan. So BRC picking up their ninth wicket. They've got one foot on that final on Friday. Yes, yeah, Samir, I think. I think I mentioned a few times today that this is not the easiest wicket to bat on. So. Once these guys got 130 plus, it's always going to be a difficult task, and um, it's a good catch. He had the presence of mind to keep his keep himself inside the boundary line. So it's a foregone conclusion, really, that um, once they didn't have that first power play, it was inevitable that Colts were going to finish this game. So, so Morais departs. He didn't trouble the scorers, although he faced four deliveries. BRC 59 for nine. It's a matter of formality now. Malka will try his best to try and salvage some something out of these remaining few overs. He's got one wicket to go before Coles celebrate their effort and make that. Booking into that final, more than one foot in that finals now. Unless of course BRC can pull off some sort of miracle here, which looks highly unlikely in the way they've batted. And you were right so early on about the pitch, Gamini. Not the easiest to bat on, and 130 turned out to be quite a competitive score. Malindu Shahan is the last batter for BRC. Oh, that's nicely played. That's one thing the spinners of Colts have done really well. They've hit the right areas. They've they've dragged the batters forward. And we've seen a lot of balls go in the air. The batter's not getting the full measure of it. And uh, to add to that, it's been some brilliant feeling as well by the Colts. I was quite surprised this morning when BRC skipper Tilakaratna called it correctly and decided to feel first because I had a good look at the pitch. Only thing that could have been in his mind is the weather. But I reckon when you That's big heave on the leg side. Didn't get the whole thing, just a single. 
you need to control the things that you can control and uh, sometimes whether is uh, yeah i know it's uh, 61 for 9 i'll come back to that well, it's been a good tournament this the slc major clubs t20 tournament lots of young talent on display and they'll all be vying for a place in uh, the topmost tournament the lanka premier league edition 3 coming up this year towards the end of july that's where it will take place 31st july to 21st august will be played at the premadasa in colombo and uh, the hambantota mahindra rajpaks international cricket stadium the registration of the overseas players happens starting today the for starting yesterday in fact the 14th of june there'll be different categories international ruby international sapphire international diamond day and b and international platinum so something that we cricket for fans and cricket followers look forward to a very very good tournament where international and local players will be on full display with five teams vying for the third Lanka Premier League trophy. Akhile Dharanja is here to wrap things up. He's bowled amazingly well, hasn't he? Two for three in his three overs. Someone who's not been picked at all by the BRC batters and he'll be someone uh, that the selectors will be looking at to come back into the national squad. Oh, that's nicely bowled. That's beautifully bowled. They're asking the question. Was it for LBW that they were appealing? It was, and uh, it was the wrong one. Yeah, pitch, uh, the impact was outside the off stump. That's a very good call. Umpires have had a good game too. Kotachi and Rambukwella. There it is. The final straw. Final nail in the coffin. Tananjir, three for three. Amazing figures. Akira Dananja, the experienced captain of Colts. At 128, they must have thought on this wicket they should be able to defend it and have they defended it so amazingly. Comprehensive victory here for them by 67 runs and they make it to that final which is to take place on Friday. BRC, a disappointment. Akira Dananja with his last wicket. Again, the one that comes back in. Looked like a leg spinner. The batsman playing a cordy into it. But it comes back right inside. Beautifully bold. Three wickets for him. And BRC, a disappointing batting effort by them. 61 all out. They lose in the semi final after a good run in the group stages. Colts, remember, were unbeaten. BRC lost just that one game and made it through because of the points on the net run rate. But this time, Colts are too good for them. The neighbors from Havelock area have made it to the finals. And they'll be playing against the two. The winners of the second semi-final, which is coming up shortly, Army versus Saracens. That will be another game that we will bring to you, but the Colts will be a happy unit. They've been comprehensive in the group stage and here too, in this knockout semi-final game, they have been on top. Like I mentioned, they are unbeaten. This was the last wicket, Akhila Dananje. Quite handy on a surface like this, which is holding on a touch. Yeah, Coles, the unbeaten team goes through uh, Samir and then um, we've got the other unbeaten team in action in the afternoon, Army. But I can tell you that this that next game is going to be a cracker. Saracens are a very good team and um, they've got very good players in their lineup. Army has got a battle. Despite losing this, it's been a good campaign by BRC. They'll be proud of the way they've gone about. They haven't had the services of their regular captain, Banu Raju Paksa, who's busy with the national team. But despite that, they've put in some good performances led by the experienced campaigner, TM Sampath, a brother of Dilshan. And they've got some good names amongst them. They've had some decent performances. Lahiru Samarkorn being one of them. He's a potential that they've looked at to... He's been betting at number three in this tournament, which is something that they've done newly. Uh, management will be looking to improve from here on and do better as the tournament progresses next year as well. 61 all out then. Coles win by 67 runs and this is how BRC batted. A decent start by TM Sampath but that they turned out to be the only decent contribution in this entire batting lineup. Wickets falling at regular intervals especially against the spinners. These batters looked absolutely clueless. All of them perishing for very little. Cole's bowlers were pretty much on, on the target. Mudita, 2 for 18, decent figures. Lakshan bowled with some um, control, 2 overs, 1 for 6. All the bowlers getting wickets. Uh, Sangeet, Batage, 
and Ron Paul picking up a wicket each. But Akhil Dhananja, who came to uh, came as the fifth bowler, picked up three for three. So that fall off wickets tells you a story, doesn't it? Kept losing wickets regularly, and there's not much in their batting that they couldn't be proud about. Started off with the boundary of the first ball. We thought that BRC would have it in control in the way the two opening batters started. TM Sempath looked really good, played a couple of very good shots like that one down the ground for a huge six. But after that, the collapse began and the wickets just kept falling. This was a very good, uh, in fact, the catch the ball after this was a very good catch by Nimesh over there at deep square leg. And since then, the wickets just kept falling. This was a superb piece of fielding. Good partnership field in there by the fielder and the bowler. One-handed take. And then onwards, it was just one wicket after the other. They just kept tumbling on the BRC batters. A few boundaries here and there in the middle. But other than that, it was a disappointing performance. Very desperate looking batting innings. This was they never really, really seemed to be in control. Yeah, the shot selection is uh, actually um, questionable, but uh, take nothing away from the um, Cools lineup. They had enough um, weapons in their armory to suit on a, a track to bowl a on a track like this that was well struck that was uh, oh, that was the one that uh, was caught the other thing is uh, Samir I think uh, one of the very important aspects of a T20 game is the fielding you can clearly say that uh, Cole's outfielded uh, BRC today indeed clicking in all three departments we thought the 128 may not be enough but on a wicket like this it seemed as if it was just enough in fact more than enough because they have the bowling to defend that kind of a total on a wicket like this. So, blue clear skies in Colombo, which is good news, but not so much good news for BRC as they barred this tournament after having won the toss, electing to field first. Coles putting on 128. BRC in reply, just managing 161. Coles win by 67 runs and they move on to the finals. And we'll find out shortly in a few hours, in, a, in about four hours time, who joins them in that final, whether it's the army, whether it's the soldiers, or whether it's the Saracens who join them in the final. As long as the rain stays away, we will be back shortly to bring you this second semi-final. Army Sports Club versus Saracen Sports Club. 1-4, one, 1.30 one is when we'll be back on air, live from this historic ground, PSR Oval Grounds. And we will bring you the live and exclusive coverage of this second semi-final. Army versus Saracens here on the Papri.com, powered by Dialogue. Until we see you again then, goodbye and good afternoon.
There's dirt on my hands Strong like a tree There's roots where I stand Oh, I've been running from the law Hope they won't shoot me down soon Catch me howling at the moon I came from the mud There's dirt on my hands Strong like a tree There's roots where I stand Oh, I've been running from the law Hope they won't shoot me down soon I came from the mud There's dirt on my hands Strong like a Try to catch me howling at the moon